Hello! Yes, finally, we're back. Farm Sim 22. Why am I back on Farm Sim 22? Well, there was a recent update to Farming Simulator 22, as everybody knows. And the unthinkable has happened. After the update, every single mod that was in my mods folder has been completely wiped. There is nothing in my mods folder at all. Which, as you can tell, really pissed me off. So at some point, I've got to go through and try and figure out all of that again. Which isn't great, but what can I do? So, we're on Carmston Farm. Uh, I was going to do Yukon Valley today, but apparently my map's gone, all my mods are gone, everything's gone. I mean, even everything I had set up for the Realistic series, everything has gone, which has severely pissed me off. But, big fat thumbs up there, Stephen, truly do appreciate that. How is your day going, buddy? And why the fuck does this sound really low? There we go. Right, so what we've done is we have started off with the main farm, the main fields. Why not? Sold off all the equipment. I've managed to go around and scrape in a few mods. <laughs> Honestly, you look like 12 mods, literally. I just haven't had time to go around and get a load of decent mods uh, again. Um, I've lost all the ones that were sent to me privately. I've lost all those as well, which isn't great. And what? Why is the rocks here? That's weird. I don't know. Well, anyway, let's get on. What do we? I don't even know what we own. Uh, we own field thirty-five, four, three, six, fifteen, two. Wow, we actually own a lot of fields. That is very annoying. Yeah, it is, Ridley. Honestly, buddy. Um, I went on today uh, to check everything because I was. Uh, Gonna stream Yukon Valley. And I loaded up the game, because, you know, you don't think to check your mods folder. Loaded up the game. Yukon Valley wasn't there. Uh, the map I was using for the real setup, I got everything set up for the realistic series. The mod that I was waiting for came out literally this morning. Believe it or not, came out this morning. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> things happen for a reason, I'm telling you. It's like you think you're going to use that map, do you? Apparently not. But I can only do what I can do. I'm human. There are going to be technological issues that do turn up. There's nothing I can do about it. But just grip my teeth and bear it. But it is what it is. I mean, there's nothing I can do about it. Right, so what fields have we got? 2, 3, 6, 15, 4, and 35. But how are you doing, Ridley? I hope you're doing well, buddy. I literally just I'm on a rant. Is that 31 or 91? What is it? 31. So is that grass? What is it? Grass? It's gra oh, wow, I own a fair amount of grass fields. But yeah, like I said, I did sell all of the equipment, the starting equipment, sold it all. And, uh, yeah, we've only got 1.3 million. And uh, it seems a lot, but it, really, honestly, it just isn't going to go that far. Anybody knows that farm sim. But like I said, I did get a couple of mods put back in. Nowhere near what I had. But, is what it is. Alright, so harvesters, I want cheap and cheerful right now. Uh, oh, look at this, John Deere 6600 side hill with a decent engine. What have we got? 1978, 1975, got to be the old boy. Let's buy you. Okay. Customize. Where's the header for this one? Side hill mod. There's got to be the header for it, hasn't there? I'm doing okay, but am I broken? You might have broken your arm. What the fuck? How the hell did you manage that? <laughs> Damn. I hope you're alright, buddy. Honestly, I hope you're fine. Um. No, oh. What should we go for? The late model fingers. Should we go for the early model fingers? The back reel galvanized or the back reel? Which one should we go for? I'll let you decide, Ridley. Which one are we going for, buddy? Well, how the hell did you manage to do that? 
So we've got the back reel, or the late model, early model, or the galvanised. Which one are we going for there, Ridley? I'll let you decide. You're a big boy now. You like me, you wipe your own ass. <laughs> See, I need mental help. I'm telling you. And it goes downhill from here, I'm telling you. And why is that up? There we go. Don't need that there. Uh, late model, okie dokie. Uh, early model, late model. There we are. Let's buy you. Uh, we do need tractors. <laughs> tractors in here, I've got to say some mm, tasty ones, some nice ones. Uh, what's that? What have we got? God, my software today has been it's just crazy. And uh, beautiful Linda there with the line, big fat thumbs up, truly do appreciate that. And hi! How you doing? Hope you're doing well. Are you cooking? You're normally cooking. So I did manage to get a couple of old tractors put in, like the Minneapolis Moline, the Internationals, uh, a Ford, some of the John Deere's, uh, and a beautiful little Massey here. So, what are we gonna? We're gonna get a couple of small tractors. I'm. I do. I want to go old school style, you know, the, the old Internationals and the old Ford. You know, I want to go old school. So let's have a look at this Ford. Who on earth made this mod? It looks... Yeah, we won't be having that Ford. Yeah, I definitely know there's a better Ford than that because I used to have one. Uh, 96 horsepower, 120 horsepower. I would go for... Yeah, I would as well, but that one's a bit... <clears throat> to be desired. Uh, I did have a lot of Ford mods. Do have this one. Oh, okay. That's. <laughs> okay. Uh, whoa! Who made this mod? <sighs> Somebody doesn't know what they're doing. What on earth is this? Jewel crop. Row crop jewels? <laughs> Fuck me, did I? <laughs> How much of a crop are they trying to fucking make? Damn! That is shocking. That is shocking. Damn, that is bad. <laughs> wow. I would go forward, but apparently... <laughs> uh, I did put these in here. Look, the old John Deere 8960. We've got the 5360 uh, IMT. We've got the versatile six-cylinder. Which, nice little mods. I almost fell over. I know, right? <laughs> yeah, some of the, the mods that I did have were on point. These ones. Yeah. 110. 120 horsepower. Please tell me this one works. <gasps> this one actually works. <laughs> <laughs> and it, it 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 works, yay! So we've got straight exhaust muffler. <gasps> Got to be a muffler. Love the old mufflers. Yeah, my sound effects are just pff. attaches. What have we got? <laughs> International sixty-eight. Where? Oh, the bar there. Hmm. Yay! I know, right? <laughs> uh, should this just be our hauling around tractor and we'll give it like... Um, I don't even know what the weight thing is for this. Uh, I want the... Muffler exhaust. Open station. Open station or cab with this one. What should we have? Yeah, it's it. What the f in hell is that? No. What? Oh, gee, I feel so claustrophobic in that. Who the f in hell would drive like. Who does that? Who? What? Who 
you supposed to get in there? Climb over your seat. Get fucked. What is that? No, that is International Windbreaker. Well, I've never fucking seen it. I'm telling you. Alright, so do we have the Hinker Cab or without? I think Open Station looks better. <laughs> I'm going Open Station. That other one just looks like absolute dog shite. Uh, what wheels are we getting? Row crops, single ribs. Where's my mouse gone? Give me my fucking mouse back. Uh, hmm. I know it sounds really weird, but I really do not like having that single wheel at the front. I'm just weird. Just don't like it. Yeah, don't like that. We'll have a weight. We'll have some weight on the back. <sighs> Fuck, that'll do. Fuck it. <laughs> Fuck it. We got a tractor, boys and girls. We got a tractor. Is it powerful? Is it fuck? But it's my tractor, and I'm really happy with it. Uh, you make me laugh. Good. That's what it's all about. <laughs> Have I even brought the right fucking header for my fields? I don't know. See that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you turn to pick up the header. Take notes, everybody. Take notes. Get out your pen and paper. Fuck me, if you took notes off me, you'd never get out done, would you? There we go, look, big boy now got an harvester. Ooh, look at it go. I'm just now realising, right, I brought this little dinky ass fucking harvester. You see how big this field is? Take me ten years to harvest the fucking field. Never again, Mr. P. Show what the fuck that. Yeah, I know, right? Yeah, those mods that don't work, yeah, they're going. Yeah, yeah, janky as shit, ain't they? I mean, no, I mean, I've converted from mods from 19 to 22, and I've never have fucking hashed it that bad. I mean, it's not back to the fucking future. It, it, it's not hard to code it in so you can get fucking tires. I mean, come on now. This actually looks pretty decent. I like how they've sunk it in there, and you've actually got stuff that. What the fuck was that? Sound like a fucking tractor just started. Start your engines. Yes, please. Let's go. Oh, I'm a big boy now. I've got a tractor as well. I'm a one-man band. I've got a farm with massive fields, and I've got one tractor and a fucking harvester. I'm on a roll. A crow. I bet the fucking crows fly faster than this fucking tractor. Uh, it's going to take you one million years to harvest that field. Do <laughs> Fucking hell, it's gonna take a long time. Ridley, come harvest this field for me, buddy. <laughs> I bet you're sat there thinking, shit, yeah, get fucked. Uh, <laughs> right. <coughs> so we need another bigger boy tractor. Mm. It definitely ain't gonna be this fucking thing, look at it. Who can't even code in a tyre? They've done the front one. It's really not difficult to code in a back tyre. Where is your trailer? I ain't got one. Poor, alright. Poor. Why? I know. I mean, look. look at that. Who does that? I mean, look. They've, they've coded in the tyre. But what the fuck is these? <laughs> what the fuck is that? They ain't even got the textures in on the wheels. Oh, <laughs> What are you doing? They ain't even textured the roof. Come on now. Come on. What is this? Disgusting is what it is. Alright, uh, we're going to pick a big boy tractor. What are we going to go for? Are we going to go for the IMT? Are we going to go for the John Deere 8960? Or are we going to go for the six cylinder versatile? Which one are we going to go for? Mm, tasty. I bet farmers feel so at peace out there in the open and the quiet, nothing but the sound of machinery and doing what they love. Exactly. Not impressed. Uh, the John Deere. Yeah, I, I just knew the fucking John Deere would win. But, oh, wait. No, what? what what's with these tyres? Seen bigger tyres on a push bike. Get out of it. Where's your fucking. 
I want extra, extra fuel tanks. Uh, front lights, give. Uh, green star, for, fuck off for an extra eight grand. No thanks. Uh, engine setup, we'll go for the big boy. Big, big boy. Big boy engine. <laughs> I agree with really. <laughs> Yeah, windows. Yes, I would like windows. I know it means the window tint. I live in fucking England. You'd never need a tint in your window. <laughs> Wheel set up. I want this. Is there like a skinnier version of those tyres? I mean, I'm in fucking England. It's, you know, we don't have like, really fat fucking roads, do we? <laughs> Look at that. Oh, it's. Mm. Mm. Nice. And we got. There are more tyre options, Mr. P. I know, but I'm in a British map and the roads are about as big as a, a postage note. <laughs> and there you go. I know, right? I'm big boy now. What, my ass? Are you proud of me? Do you know what? I'm going to get the six cylinder as well just because I can, because I'm an asshole. Uh, engine. Yes, please. Ooh, for an extra nine grand. Yeah, get fucked. Um, oh, 220 horsepower. Yeah, fuck you. You'll lose. Actually, no, I think I'll take it, I'll take it, shh, I'll take it, shh, 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 don't listen to, don't listen to anybody, shut your mouth. I want the versatile as well, fuck it, just because I can, it's only 30 old grand. Shut up, don't judge me, alright? Finally, I got tired of doing it, <laughs> just because you can, exactly, see? Ridley gets it. Like I used to say, ages ago, my stream, do what I fucking want. Oh, look at this truck, I just go, what the f Fuck is that? Is that supposed to be wood or rust? Wood doesn't rust. Fuck is that? It's shinier than my bald spot. Get out of it. What? Oh, it's ugly as sin. I love it. I'm buying it. Yes, please. <laughs> oh, fuck me. It's in the bushes where it belongs. Disgusting behaviour. <laughs> <All right. laughs> Damn. Oh, let, let's just take a moment to listen to this. Mmm. Nice. Oh, this ain't even got a fucking CD yet. All these big machinery we're getting, lot, and I got a dinky little harvester. One of these fucking tires is bigger. All right, let's put this big boy away. Uh, is this it? Tell you what. Made more sense, you know, to move this big tractor out of the way so we can get the little one in. You know, to be sensible. He says. <laughs> Go on in your own time, international, no rush. There we go, move the big boy out of the way. Let's get the small one in. There we go, look at it, like a glove. Oh, it was meant to be. Oh, you sexy little beast. Mm. Oh. Wow. What the fuck did you put these stickers on with? MS DOS? Fuck is that? See, so if you squint, look, if you put the camera all the way out here, squint, tilt your head slightly. The letters don't look that bad, do they? I mean, look. You're some welly to it, innit? Oh, look at it. Mm. I'm a big boy now. I wipe my own ass. Mm. Here we go, here we go. Oh, look. Oh, it's a dirty man's dream. No, they don't. Come on, you can't tell me. Them stickers where it says versatile looks like it was put on with MS DOS. Look at it. Just, just look, look at it. I mean, where's the rest of the eight? Is it under the wheel somewhere? <laughs> Fucking hell. Oh, this truck is ugly, I love it. Ooh. Who doesn't love rusty wet wood? Fuck. Bit shiny, innit? Bit shiny? And I've got a trailer yet, and I've already brought a truck. 
I know what my priorities are. Do you? Ugliest in front and centre. Oh. Just look at this beast. Look. Dirty, dirty. I mean, there's not a bit of the fucking dust on this. This is a nice though, isn't it? It's that ugly. It's nice. You ever seen them small dogs that women have? Fuck me, it looks like they've had the red slammed in a door. They're that fucking ugly, they're cute. Mm. <laughs> Shut up, don't judge me, alright? <laughs> alright, we need a trailer. Uh, oh. <laughs> We're going to need a pretty big trailer. Uh, what are we going to go for? What about the Wilson? Will that actually fit anywhere? Crampy, have they changed that? Hmm. What trailer should we get? We're going to probably need about 500 of them. <laughs> but yeah, what trailer should we get? The fuck is that thing? Side dump. That just looks weird. I mean, this thing, right? Look at this. Looks like someone's just gone, yeah, just, just throw that on that base, will you? <laughs> Did the fucking miss a bit and mismeasure it? Come on. What the fuck is all this wasted space? Could have got more crops in there. Don't lie to me. <laughs> Disgusting. <laughs> right, what trailer are we getting? Let me know. A class trailer. I don't even think my fucking harvester will reach over that. Is that the only one? It is, isn't it? You're going to make my harvester struggle. You're a bastard. Uh, how much does this hold? 12. Actually, that's not fucking bad. Will. We'll go for the big wide boys. Mm. Yes, please. Mm. Yeah. There we go. Let's see, we've got the fucking trailer. Oh, there you are. <laughs> Hi. I don't know the way there. Is that in the ground? No. Shut up, right? Don't judge me. I'm a big boy now. What man has? Let's see, we've got my harvester. I hope my harvester. <laughs> I hope my harvester reaches over that. Uh, the thing is now, need a class tractor. Eh, yeah, I got, I got this big boy. Look at it. Look how powerful it is. Them two, they're, they're all right. They've got a bit of power, but this boy, mm. God, this will be, this will be pulling that like it's, oh, like it's nothing. Smooth as a fucking Porsche. I'm telling you. God, this is going to take so fucking long to harvest, isn't it? Piss off, mate. Suck a fat. Oh, look, I've got room round here. Where's my fucking silo? <laughs> Where's my silo? Si Don't tell me my silo's in here. Because I'm going to be here all fucking day trying to reverse in here. What's in here? Oh, I've got some room. Hey, look at that. Hey, look, we found a tyre. We could have used that for the Ford. <laughs> What's this over here? Turn off the lights when not in use. Well, I'm in here now and I'm not even using the lights. I'm frugal, mate. I'm frugal, I'm telling you. Frugal. So where the, f the fuck is my... Where is it? You're probably there screaming at the TV pointing. It's over there, you idiot. <laughs> where the fucking hell's me... Where is it? Hey? Did I leave that door open? Did I? Oh, but fuck me, them windows need to clean. Go to the front. Oh, I knew that. I was testing you. Alright, so, round here, is it? In one of these. Surveillance cameras and alarms. Well, you're not really any fucking use if you're pointing over there. Point down here. Alright, is it in here? Oh, look, I found it all by myself. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, what's this? Too, it's been that long since I've been on this map. I'm looking at it. I'm like, yeah, fuck you know that. Like a proper British farm. I'm telling you, everything's everywhere. Oh, that's handy, isn't it? Probably get one piece of machinery in and around. I mean, come on, what? Who? What farmer does this? Oh yeah, I'll cut through my farm. I'll drive through here and go. Oh look. 
because that's useful. Let's limbo through these. Ooh. Oh, that much makes a noise. Dude, I've been on here for 26 minutes, 28 seconds. I've not even fucking started farming yet. Skill. That's what that is. <laughs> that takes fucking skill. <laughs> Got my dirty bean water. I'm prepared. Need to be for this fucking field. Ridley, come harvest this field for me. Peeing. Must peeing yourself now. On point. Ridley, come do this field, mate. Got bone in my arm, it hurts. Tell you what. Oh, there's the second tyre! The different, but at least the fucking there. Is there another one? We're gonna spare? Where's that Ford? I found a second tyre for it. Are they the same? Hmm. Are these the same? They're the same! We've got two wheels for the Ford! Chow time! Whee! What you got? I wanna know what you've got Cause I'm fucking greedy I dare you to buy the Ford Oh, <laughs> you daring me to buy the Ford? It's gonna look hideous! Look, look, back to the future. I'm telling you, it's fucking hideous. I mean, I'm gonna have... To, I'll tell you what, I will find another Ford and we'll buy that one, but I am not getting that friggin' thing. This one, I'll tell you what, I'll, we'll, I'll buy this one for you. How's that? Sacrifices I'm having to make here. The sacrifices. I feel violated. There's a dirty taste in my mouth. I just feel abused. I'll get you this Ford, how's that? You can take this one, or nothing at all at the minute. At least this one's got fucking tyres. <laughs> Save your game! Is that a fan? What the... Mr. P and the magic tyres. Is there something wrong with like, the front wheel here? What's going on? What's going on? So we'll buy this Ford. Surely it can't look that bad inside, can it? <laughs> We're about to find out. Left over fried chicken, made some fries and bread. Ooh. Nice. I want, I want fried chicken. Sean Pierce, big fat thumbs up, my friend. How are you doing, my friend? I've got to say, I don't have your mod anymore. I don't have your mod anymore. Uh, Farming Simulator 22 updated and it literally wiped all my mods out of my mod folder. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> Lost everything. Gee, ooh. Still, oh, gee, this is janky as hell, isn't it? Look at the state of this. But how you doing, Sean? I hope you're doing alright, my friend. What's this look like inside? Ridley, I blame you for this. Look at the state of in here! I strangled a smurf for the seat. Uh, fuck it, it'll do. Ridley, I'm blaming you for this Ford. Fuck me, really responsive for reversing, innit? Look at the state of that! Jeez, who made this mod? Somebody make me a decent Ford. This one's disgusting. <laughs> Don't like it. It's horrible. Ridley, it's all your fault, mate, I'm telling you. Blaming you for that thing there. This is... I don't even know what that is. It's not a Ford, is it? Look. I mean, someone just come over and just fucking sprayed it blue and slapped a sticker on it. They're like, there you go, look, got a Ford now. <laughs> Fuck off, do you? It's dirty. Sell it? I wouldn't even give it away. <laughs> Disgusting. No, I've got to make sure I've got swath on. Oh, fuck me. I didn't even turn that off, did I? Uh, that's not what I want then. This is what I want. Uh, disable straw swath. I think it probably could have took me about 10 years to pick up the straw, innit? <laughs> I ain't even got a bailer. 
<laughs> Look, mate, this is going to take a long time. I don't even know if this thing will reach over that trailer. You need to unfold the harvester. Oh, here we go. Look at this bad boy. Oh, here we go. Ooh, oh, yes! There you go. <laughs> oh my, look at how long this is going to take. Oh, we're going to whop him four miles an hour, guys and girls. Go, fasten your seat belts. The DeLorean's got nothing on. Look at it go. Probably uses more gas than it does crop. Oh, it'd be stunning, isn't it? Hey, look at it go. It's a beast! <laughs> oh dear. Really, I still blame you for that Ford. That is dirty. You've done me the dirty there. You did it to yourself, Mr. P. I was forced. But, you know, I like making progress. I want to, you know, start off with hardly just look the, the low end machinery and earn enough money to get the big machinery, you know, if that makes sense. Oh, look at that guy. Oh, it's a bit... Away, fuck off. Look at that. That could be the price of a bag of crisps. I am not leaving that bit of crop. Get lost. That is not happening. 50 million years later. Yep. Global warming is now no longer a thing. There's no such thing as icebergs. There's a little big boy now, though. I'll tell you what, considering we've gone from round there to here... I'm already at 13%. So it looks nice inside though, look at it. Hey? Better than that fucking board. I don't know what was going on with that. Mm. Got a look at beauty in it. Oh. Get this field done in about 10 years. I actually don't mind this though. I mean, uh, in one of my uh, videos, uh, when I was doing a like, video series on the Valley of the Old Farm, I actually used the John Deere land, uh, the old Massey, or was it the old, the old Ferguson, uh, and the old plant, potato planter, the one row potato planter, I actually planted it, planted, planted it, planted and harvested a whole field using the whole old equipment for potatoes. I loved every single minute of it. Cause I'm a widow. Oh yeah, look at this. It's gonna take me about 13 minutes to get this field done. Yeah, 13 minutes away from 50 years. Yeah, I'm in no rush. Hey you. Beast. I love it. I'm not being funny, but would you really do this to yourself in real life? You would, wouldn't you? Because if you've only got this equipment, you can't exactly do, you know, what you do on farm sim. Ah, yeah, well, I don't want this one. I've had it for a year. I traded me old girl for like something like the ideal or the Takano. So how's everybody's day been? No. Not in real life, really. I would. I totally would. But I've not even made it um not even made it halfway round yet. We're already at for 30 uh, 35 percent capacity. Obviously, you're not going to watch me do the whole field. We'll get a worker on it. And we'll, uh... It depends what the price is. Because I don't want to get a baler. I'm going to need a swather as well. Uh, should we do bales or should we pick it up loose? Do we do animals? Do we do... I don't know. What, 
What animals do you get around this farm? Is it cows, sheep, pigs? I'm not really sure. Pigs, in my... Yeah, since I've been playing farm sim, honestly, pigs have just never really been worth doing. They're just... they're not worth doing. Cows? We could look at doing cows. We'll get like a little skid steer. Get some forks put on the old international, the farm all. Oh, look at this, I mean, a whopping speed. Don't stop me now. Just, have you ever seen a harvester go so fast? No, you haven't. Shut your mouth. Lovely. I hope that's not, I hope that's not sugar meat over there. No, oh, it's not my field. <laughs> Good, because I would have soon told someone to get in there with the old, uh, the old cultivator. <laughs> That's going. It was an actual fluke. I didn't even know what was in the fields, and I went out and brought this header. You know, skill. 51%. I tell you what, if this gets all the way round, I'll be very surprised. I'd be really surprised if this does get all the way around there. Because we're at 54% now, we've gone around all that. Do you guys and girls think we'll get all the way around? We've just got to get to there. We've already gone around... If I zoom out. We've already gone all the way around there. Uh, something satisfying about watching each line get cleared. I know, right? I love it. Fuck off, Stephen. <laughs> but yeah, we'll get some cows for you, Ridley. But you've got to name every single one of them. And you've got to remember all the names. If one of them gets sick, I don't want complaints. Say, oh look, Deborah's not doing well. Karen stood on her hoof. Barbara's not doing all right. She's got cough. Okay, I don't even know where I come up with half of this crap. You've got to be careful with that Deborah though. Right, fucking sneaky. She jumps over the fence like a hurdler and eats me fucking crop. Dirty Deborah. I tell you what, there's probably someone out there called Deborah sat there thinking, no, I fucking don't. <coughs> uh, Stephen, uh, one day I hope you will be impressed. I know, right? You should be fucking impressed. I'm doing this field in a massive harvester. I mean, have you ever seen something so big in your life? So what's everybody's plans for tomorrow? I hope everyone's uh, got some decent plans. Do you want to know what my plans are? Sweet FA. There's a YouTuber dagger in that plays uh, this map and others. He's a very good at it in my opinion. Yeah, I know Dagoin, he's the icons that little blue truck. Yep. Uh, if you do want to watch another good, very, very good, well, two very good people that uh, do farming simulator content there, Ridley, uh, please head on over to uh, Warco, Warco Entertainment, the guy I normally stream with for a laugh. Uh, he does fantastic farming simulator content, uh, as well as uh, my good friend Seba, that is C for cat, C. E E B U R Seba. They do fantastic farming simulator 22 stuff. Deborah's cow name. Yep. Dirty Deborah. Bessie or uh, Bessie, Bertha, Bella. Gee, how many cows are we having? You gotta remember which is which. 
So is Deborah the one with the white with brown spots or is she brown with white spots? You need to know which one she is, so when we're walking round you can go, oh look, there she is. There's Deborah, there's Bessie, there's Bertha, there's Bella. Names, what names? You know I'm gonna forget these names, so you lot are gonna have to remind me. That's mad. We wow, we actually made it round. That's actually impressive. That is actually impressive. Right, that's one lap. Are you ready for another 764? Oh, here we go. Look at this marvel in techno. Fuck me, is that going to be high enough? <laughs> I don't... <laughs> it don't look that high, does it? What? Uh... Can we have... 456,678 I don't think you can have that many I don't have that much land but, yeah, You'd end up having to own like, all this land with all with uh, cow panics to get that amount like, Every single field's got cows in it You'd never do any real farming would you in fields? But like, oh, today's stream, we are sorting cows. Check out tomorrow's stream when we will be sorting out the cows. Right, let's go. Get the fantastical Ford. I think I might have to sell it. I'm sorry, but I've got <laughs> it's horrible, isn't it? Ridley, can I sell the Ford? Oh, look at it! I don't want to look at it, is that? No, get away, I'm not looking at it when I get in. Oh, jeez, I've got to look at it. I've got to, oh. I've got to look at it, Ridley. I've got to look at it. Look at that, no! Oh! <laughs> I love four tractors, but I don't know what the heck this is supposed to be. Is that... Oh, it's actually high enough. Alright. I knew that, I was testing you. <coughs> skills. That's what that is, skills. I really don't like that Ford. Ridley, you did it to me. I can't believe you did that to me, Ridley. What even is this thing? What are you? Definitely a freaking Ford, that's for sure. Has anybody ever seen Kindergarten Cop? They go, who's your daddy and what do you do? I feel like looking at this channel because what are you? Where do you come from? What factory? These things need to be answered because you're definitely not a damn Ford. It's not, is it really? Come on, let's be honest. Wait, there is a glitch in the O. There is, look, they can't even put a sticker on correctly. It's like it's the Ford something else and they've just gone, yeah, slap the 8000 on it. Look at that. <laughs> I don't like it. <laughs> it's horrible. It's disgusting. There we go, look. Oh, powerhouse, back in action. There we go. So what we'll do is... Realistically, we won't be able to get a lot of cows. Because we're going to have to get all the feed for them and things like that. But we do have a fair amount of grass, so we can get hay. We just need to, obviously... Ted it, windrow it. Loose would probably be easier. 
but I'm not sure if the silo on this game is a multi fruit silo that accepts hay or straw. Does anybody know? Does it actually accept hay and straw? It's the biggest harvester in the world! Exactly, look at it, the beast! Feast your eyes! Under John Deere side hill 660 hundred. 660 hundred? Jeez. No, not that I know of. Fuck! Looks like we're making bales. Okay. I'm just a gluten for punishment. Trying to think, how many cows should we get? I'll tell you what, let's just throw a worker in there. Look okay, you going! Round bales. You just want them to roll away, that's what you want. I know your game. Field info, oh jeez, will you get off field info, jeez. Jeez, go away field info, where are you, get off. Don't care. Round bales, let's make some round bales. That, ooh. Makes me cringe. Ooh. <laughs> what are you? It's like someone just dodged a fear angry and painted it blue. Dirty is what that is. Dirty. Shouldn't be allowed. It's against the law. Oh. Look, someone literally just slapped an 8000 sticker on it. Look, you can see just there. Hi Ford, I love you. Close your eyes, quick. I tell you what, honestly, I have seen some really. I did used to have some really good Ford mods, but that one. Right, Baylor, we're not going to be able to afford a big boy. Uh, New Holland, forty-five horsepower. Or not if I yeah, I'm going for the case. Right, case on New Holland. because uh, the power for this thing's gonna be a bit much. Unless we buy another tractor and get rid of the Ford. But it'll get the old uh, international something to do if we get one of these two. What are we going for? Are we going for the New Holland or are we going for the case? Case. Sorted, there we go, that was the big boy decision one it. Here we go. Oh, shh. It's okay. It's okay. Nobody likes that nasty Ford. <laughs> Honestly, though, I've seen some really bad mods in my time, but that one. Not missing like It's like it was made in MS DOS. I've seen better things made in MS Paint. I've converted better mods. I'm not saying something. There we go. Let's get some bailing done. I'm just going to turn around a bit. There we go. Oh, no. That's a small tractor. Hey, hey, shh, shh, shh. You don't mean it. Hey, this has got more than enough power. Look at this. Hey. Eat your words, Ridley. Eat your words. He didn't mean it. It's fine. Just ignore him. Ford, bigger than that. Shh. Shh. Ford's busy. Twenty horsepower. I'm sure, it has. I think. I'm 
sure this has got 120 horsepower. Hi, Ford. Honestly, I do agree that Ridley. There are some beautiful Ford mods out there, but that's not one of them. That really is. Jeez, what are they doing in the harvester? You see that? What are they doing? It is in it. Honestly, I have never seen a Ford so bad in my life. You need a refund. I fucking need something. That is disgusting. I feel violated. <laughs> <laughs> Devin, big thumbs up, buddy. There you go. How you doing, Devin, my friend? How you doing? I would say I'll show you a, a sexy Ford, but I don't want to upset you. It's fucking horrible. I've never seen a mod so bad in my life. I just feel violated. <laughs> just don't feel right having it on my farm. It is that bad. Because the Ford is a bad name. Holy shit. Thanks for that share there, Devin. Truly do appreciate it, my friend. How's your day been? Hopefully doing alright. We've all heard that Ridley loves his Ford. Yeah, you've had a fair fucking need more than a few fucking wheels for it. <laughs> Yeah, uh, yeah, I, I think I'd certainly walk around with the field with the shovel and the hoe. Um, what do we got? Uh, how are you, my man? And this is my lifestyle during the summer. And I'm with my dad at 500 acre farm. Holy shit! Uh, go up, man, off the weekend. Shitty hours this week, eh, feeling? I'm actually feeling a lot better now. Uh, just got a bit of a sniffle. Um, gonna niggle, but other than that, I am fine, buddy. I am fine. A bit pissed off that Farming Simulator 22 updated and I lost all my mods out of my mods folder. You know, they literally just got up and fucked off. But other than that, I'm doing great. Ridley loves his Ford. You wanna see it? Yeah, I've definitely gotta sell that Ford. That is the most shittiest, hideous thing I have ever seen in my life. And I've seen some shit mods. I don't, don't get me wrong, I don't like slagging modders off or saying that their mods are bad. But I could have probably done a better job in MS Paint. Uh, at least there's still a Ford. No, it gives a Ford a bad name. Honestly though, I will look for some mods for Fords and we will get one. I'll get rid of that one. It is just bad. I'll get rid of that one and I will get you another Ford. Definitely be a lot better than that one. Even if I have to convert the damn thing myself from 19. I will get a Ford. Ba, 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 ba. It's got no wheel. It's got no back wheels. It's got no wheels. Honestly, I will get another Ford. Fuck off my field. Yeah, tomorrow I'll have a look and I'll see if I can get one. Well, I'll, I will get one. I'll get about probably about 12 of them. It's going to be better than that one, that's for sure. That one's going uh, night night. That one's going bye bye. Now are you impressed by this farmer? 
beautiful. So, you know, this ain't a bad, uh, bad bailer, is it? I know it won't. It's obviously whoever's converted it, because uh, with 19 to 22, uh, when you convert mods, you've been mining. I wish. Literally, I've lost every single mod. I've lost the map. I've lost the Yukon map. I've lost the edits I did to it. I've lost all the mods I had on there. Literally, I've lost everything, buddy. I literally had to go around quickly that 10 minutes before I started streaming this just to get a couple. And the fantastical Ford apparently was one of them. Crossover between a cow and a donkey. It's a doubt. No man, sorry to hear that. A lot of work gone. Yep. It is what it is. So it's like everything I had done behind the scenes, set up behind the scenes for the realistic mining series as well. All that's gone. The whole lot. Everything. Thought vision matter. Yeah, that Ford's going night night, I'm telling you. It's over there. Just don't look at me, Ford. Don't look at me. Anyway, you can get it back. No, literally, I, I updated Farm Sim and my whole mods folder. Literally, the whole folder I had all my mods in is gone. All gone. The whole lot. Makes me sad. Uh, oh. This, oh, look. Ah. Oh, look, they can't even put the sticker on the 8000 right. Look, they've just literally thrown it on someone else. No. Oh. Oh. I'm a farmer, get me out of here. Uh. I tell you what, we could keep this tractor just to clean up the cow shit. You're mean. Just throw a scraper on it, drive it backwards so we don't have to look. Oh dear. Uh, I mean, it is that bad. Look inside. I mean, look at that, that gauge. Wonder why maybe a glitch in the game. I would have uh, restarted the computer and seen if it popped up. I tried, but I tried. It's just ever since the farm sim updated, it literally wiped out all my mods. I can't, it doesn't matter if I can go to a last save or not. The mods aren't there. The map's not there. Everything's gone. <coughs> the, the whole, all of my mods in the mods folder have literally just all been. They've, they've all vanished. They've got. Oh, look. Uh, don't look at me, Ford. Sweat and tears. Yeah. I'll put a lot of work into that, but. Is what it is. Oh, jeez, look at that. Oh, the Ford. I just... <clears throat> this 
is that, that ain't a Ford, is it? It's just... I don't know what it is. I don't even think this tractor knows what it is. But yeah, tomorrow I'll have a look around at uh, some Ford mods. I'm going to get a better one than this, because this is absolute shit. I'd say, fuck it, something. It's like going to a class dealer, isn't it? You're there to buy a class tractor, and they roll out with, uh, say, like, uh, a, a, you know, a Massey. You go, well, wait a minute, that, that's not what I paid for. I've been duped. Dirty bastards. No Oliver tractors yet. I did have. I did have. Because I converted one of them myself. But yeah, that's gone bye bye. Makes me sad. I lost my fucking Oliver. Hmm? Yeah, I've already said I've got See you tomorrow. Fuck me, they don't want to give me much room in there, do they? Can this tractor even turn that good? Fucking hope so. I don't like this tractor. It's not a Ford, it's an imposter. It's like going to a third world country and asking for a Lamborghini and they give you something that's like a Bamberini. No. Do you sell any of them fast Italian cars, the Bamberini? Look is that? It's the off-brand. What about them red ones? The Papari? Oh god. Uh, Oliver is a real old company they haven't made for years. Love or five. Yeah, same as Oliver, uh, White, Farmall, all the same. Uh, love for five years, 12 tractors together. My dad buys and restores them. Very expensive. Uh, to the right, but yeah, they are. Oliver tractors are really expensive. Especially the ones with the fuel fenders. Get out my fucking farm. Oh, I don't like this. I'm going to have to sell this Ford. I'm sorry. I just can't. I don't like looking at it. Get it. Get it out my fucking farm. That is hideous. I have never seen such an abomination of a tractor in my life. Ford, fuck off. Get out. Get. Just get gone. Put you in the local paper for free. You're fucking disgusting. Uh, so what's replacing it? <gasps> Minneapolis Marine for five grand. Don't need it, but fuck you, I'm getting it. <laughs> Shut your mouth. Uh, that, oh, that is just hideous. Uh, 105, 105, 120. 102. What about this John Deere, the two-wheel drive John Deere, look? The 6020. What do you think about that? Or should we go for one of these ones? 6020 or the 6300? Which one do we get? Because we've already got one of these. Which John Deere? Illusion. That fucking Ford. <laughs> We're gonna fucking nightmares now, I'm telling you, Devin. <sighs> fucking nightmares. Ridley, nightmares. Uh, well, yeah, you can visit over here and help this summer in the hayfield if you like tractors that much. Oh, I do. Uh, you, you can drive them all day, lol, more than welcome. Uh, whereabouts are you? If you're in the US, I can't get over there, buddy. But if you're in the UK, I'll come over and help you. <laughs> Fuck all else doing. <coughs> 
So I'm going to turn my camera off, have a quick sneaky cigarette. But I still will be here, burning everybody's eyes with that dirty ass food. <laughs> I'm just glad I sold it. So which for uh, which uh, John Deere are we getting? Are we getting the 6020 Premium MFWD? Are we getting the uh, John Deere Premium uh, Two Wheel Drive? Are we getting the 6300? Yeah, the US. You're not allowed over here. Uh, yeah, I am. Should be allowed. I'm a UK citizen. Should be. Should be allowed. Oh, my nose. Should be allowed over there. You sold the Ford while I was gone. No, it accidentally fell off a cliff. It had an accident. And unfortunately, the rear axle and the... Uh, the, the hits needed to be skimmed too much of the engine. So, you know, I just had to... Uh, Unfortunately, I had to let the old girl go. <laughs> it was hideous. I will, uh, tomorrow, Ridley, I will get you a Ford. I promise. I'll get you one. I don't like that fucking works. It'd be handy, I do. Uh, okay, that's why I asked. Thought you said uh, you wasn't. Like I said, more than welcome. You can be our raker for the summer. <sighs> Ooh. So which tractor were we getting? Which one? Let me know. Pick a tractor. I want to get some work done. I've been going for over an hour and eight minutes, and I've got I've harvested like six rows. <laughs> done a lot of work, all right. Done a lot of work. Don't judge me. Or Baylor, whichever you prefer. LOL. I need something big for before. Need power. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Uh, 120. Five stone tires. Waffle. <laughs> oh, dear. Waffle. Engine set up. What do we got? 120. Yes, please. Oh, jeez. Oh, there's a cat at the window. Bear with me. Huh, I'm back. 6300. Oh, jeez. Need to say room now. Yeah, but which one? This has got 105. We just got 120. Which one? Both the bleeding same by the looks of it. Both the damn same. What's the freaking difference? Apart from that one looks like it hasn't got any damn glass. Uh engine set up. Hundred and five. Alright, we'll buy that one. <laughs> Left. Did I pick the right one then? Oh, jeez. I didn't pick them. <laughs> Fuck me. Alright, what? 
Small tractors. Right, you go. You go. Let's get the one on the left. Where are I? That one. We're gonna get cold! Here we go. Engine set up. 105. Bye. There we are. Oh, I'll just get the old Minneapolis Moline out of the way. Powerhouse of the tractor. Look at it. Say, is this thing going to even reverse? Damn. Of course, that's like one of them things that is. That is so loud. Yeah. Mm hmm. There we are. The John Deere. You happy now, Ridley? But honestly, tomorrow I will look at getting you a Ford. But the harvest has stopped. Has it? Yeah. Yeah, that was loud though, wasn't it? Like, really loud. Go get this crop. Are you streaming tomorrow? Should be. If you want me to stream this, I can do. I'm done. One hour and 13 minutes, and look, I've done all this hard work. Look. <laughs> Thanks for letting me know, Stephen. That truly does help, buddy. Thanks for that like there, Ridley. We'll throw my old camera back on. Here we go. Burn everybody's eyeballs. Thanks for that, mate. Sure do appreciate that. Uh, I'm falling asleep off and on. It's alright, buddy. At the end of the day, real life always comes first. Don't worry about it. Real life will always come first. It's actually a nice John Deere. What's that? I do like it. Nice. Open cab. What you doing? It's me crop, you sponge. Seriously, they just don't care, do they? Yeah, but you know what I mean? Yeah, I know what you're going through, buddy. Stop you there. Run, short faticus. Tell you what, this cat right, of mine, it's got a load of comfy places to lay and sit and everything, and he chooses to lay on a cardboard box. He's not normal. There we go. There we go. Gonna get a fair few bales. So we do need possibly get something, some spikes or something to pick these bales up. <coughs> or just buy a loader just to make it easier. Straighten out, there we are. You got it, old girl. Come on. Ford had a cab, though. Can you call it that? 
I mean, half the dashboard wasn't even in the right place. It's just weird. But honestly, buddy, I will get you a four tomorrow. I will get you one. I'll stream this uh, hopefully tomorrow. Uh, I am going to be streaming hopefully again with Warco tomorrow. So we will have that. But, uh, yeah. I will get you a Ford. You're more than welcome, buddy. Like I say, it's always my channel has always been about the people that watch. I don't call you followers. I don't call you fans or Mr. P's crap. Whatever the fuck people say. At the end of the day, you're my friends, and that's what matters. You watch me be an absolute idiot normally, so you know your friends. That's what it's always about. Your friend, are you sure? Well, I don't know, you know, I was having second doubts. Second doubts, second thoughts, fuck me. I need to get my words out. <laughs> English is hard. Oh, I'm glad I picked that exhaust. Look at it. Oh, it's just. It just suits it. I'm not sure, how many, how many cows should we really get? Then that would depend how many bells we need, because are we really going to need all of this straw? I definitely know we're not going to be needing to buy any more fucking land. Don't get me wrong, there are times when, you know, I want to use big machinery and all this other, but I love using the old stuff. Nostalgia. Just, I love it. Sorry, I mean, no, no. <clears throat> so, some itches can get contagious. Yeah, I'm not having that many cows. But yeah, we'll get 15. I think to start off with, we'll have to buy some TMR. I can't make it at the moment. Of course, you know, we'll have to get a straw blower and things like that. We will actually go and pick up the cows in a transport trailer rather than you know, just zipping on there. I wonder how many bales I've got so far. Is that my baler that made that like banging noise? Oh yeah. Alright. PTO's rattling a bit. There was already a cow pasture on the map. Yeah. Yeah, but I'm still going to need the feed for them. So we don't have hay. We've got the straw. Uh, 
you now need um, that other stuff. Mineral feed or whatever the fucking hell it's called now. We actually might need all of these bales, won't we? Put like a couple in storage in that unit like over there. Because I know we've got about three fields that are ready to harvest, I think. From a quick glance. So that's uh, probably Facebook. Let me have a look at my old streaming software. Jeez, oh, it's right over my eye. And um, it's got to be Facebook. Because my streaming software is saying everything's really fine. I don't know. Uh, you don't have to have minimal sure. Really? Okay. That'd be good if we don't, but if we do, we get it. It's fine for me. Yay, it's probably just... It depends what area you're in, what the, what the weather's like. Hopefully it's fine for everybody else. If we do, it's only one pallet. Okay, well that's not too horrible then one pallet I can cope with. But is this map actually set up for minimum um, mineral feed? I'm not sure. Hmm. Oh, the riches. A mixture. Mm. What the heck is on my get off my pad? There we go. How good does that harvest the lot? Going alongside this. Ah. Oh. Love it. I've only done it twice, I think, throughout the stream, but only like for two seconds. And like, oh, that's not too bad, that's not horrible. Uh, it looks like that's getting pretty full. Uh, what's my cat's name? I have two cats, Mama P has uh, four. And my two cats, one's called Orion, as in, you know, Galaxy Orion's Bell. And my other one is called Maui. M A U I, Maui. I've got Orion and Maui. Mama P's got Zaza, Zizi, Zozo, and Bluey. I know that. This old uh, farm all's doing its job, isn't it? And there you are all doubting me. How dare you? Wash your mouth out. I definitely have to look at getting that Oliver. Oh, get some real old tractors going. So I know this is going to take a long time, but I don't mind doing it.
You're having fun there, buddy. Close his boat. Right, let's get in. There we go. Let's go. Try and get there before he's uh, full. that good in cab of reversing. You're going to see how bad my reversing is. We'll go this way, it's just easier. Get around that corner, was it? A big boy now. Just put in the old silo. So we do own a field here. Not worth getting a decent getting a cut on that. Oh, look at that. All by myself. Are you impressed? You should be, because I am. <laughs> Normally it doesn't go that smoothly. Wow, that ain't big quick. I think I've, one of my farts had lasted longer than that. I actually think that's the first... Oh, well, that's how we'll, The first time that I've ever had this um, trailer. Some bad trailer. Uh, nope, never. Must have got to get through there. Oh, look at that international. Oh, it just suits in there, doesn't it? Oh.
And we're off. I don't know what's going on with that worker going turning around that way. I mean, it's crazy. Yeah, 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 not all farm sims, so you've got to be, got to admit. I've been derpy as anything, they really have. Absolutely useless at times. Best thing to come out was auto drive, of course, mate. Let's have a look at this. Crazy. Madness. Madness. Head down. Yep. Let's go. would help if I lowered it. <sighs> like that. Normally helps, doesn't it? Oops, my bad. Vintage machinery, love it. Just love using the old machinery on farm sim. I still say farm sim, they really do need to stop bringing out like vintage DLCs, like of really old equipment. I would love that, but they don't, and it makes me sad. really do it's like they focus too much on all the new stuff but yet you look in like the Facebook groups and uh, and other social media platforms how many people actually use the vintage equipment the older style John Deere's Massey's internationals uh, and things like that like with me I, I love using the white uh, you know the uh, the Oliver's Minneapolis and Leans, the Internationals. I love using them. Absolutely love it. We've got a fair few bales here. Uh, is it going to be worth doing all of them? It might actually be worth doing them all. I don't know. Cost a bit of money in a worker, but we'll be all right. We'll be all right. So we need 15 cows. I need to remember that. Quickly write that down. There we go. OCD will kick my ass if I don't get them. 
do have a full rain tank, really, already. Okay. Huh. Got a lot of bales. Yay! Could get a bale trail and just lift them up with my hands. bales have we actually created? Uh, 16 bales? Wow, that's actually not that much. I thought we did more bales than that, considering. Hmm. Huh. 16 bales and we've only done that area. We're going to get a fair amount of bales off this. Field 6 is ready to harvest as well. Field 2, nothing in it. 15, 31 and 4 is grass. And we do have a large cow barn. Which is real handy. We have a silo over there, do we? Well, there's fuel. There's that. That's slurry. That's obviously just drop the food off. Hmm. Was is that mineral feed? I don't know. What's that to drop off then? I don't know. Hmm. I don't know. That's obviously the milk. That water. So, oh, can I actually go in there? Pretty useless, but okay. Uh, what have we got in here? Okay, we can add a cow stuff over here and there. Put the straw bales in here, under here, should I say? Uh, my mother used to have one of these kind of like this. Obviously one isn't in that that condition. But Mum of used to have one of those. Do I own this field here? I think I do. Oh jeez. That's another big field. Uh, is this mine here? Oh it is. Oh that's handy. Okay. And obviously this is as well then. I can't find it kind of weird that this isn't mine down here. I own those buildings there, but I don't own this bit of grass. Alright. Okay. What a bit flirty bit. If that's supposed to be empty, and why hasn't that gone yet? Harvester, what are you doing?
can't. Uh, I'm just going to have to quickly go to the short fat man's room and I'm going to make some dirty bean water. So what I'll do is I'll leave you here for a second. I'll turn the old camera off so you can uh, enjoy the view. I will be back momentarily. Like I say, short fat man's rooms, call in my name and so is some dirty bean water. I am back. Yes, the short fat man. Put that dirty taste in your mouth. Here we go. Whew. That was hard work, wasn't it? All right, where's? Oh, there you are. So what's everybody up to now? Hope you're also keeping out of trouble and staying safe. Right, let's swing around.
just making sure. Everyone's gone quiet. I think you've all fell off the planet. Uh, get it. Ooh. Get ready to get in the baby and sleep and relax. Oh, sounds beautiful. Still that little piece here that needs doing, but not too bad. Well, cab for a bit so you can see. Yeah, the baler is actually in pretty decent proportion to the tractor. Normally, you get some balers that look absolutely huge and way out of proportion to the tractor and baler. Still got a fair bit to do though, look at that. Oh. We'll get there though, we'll get them done. Just looks the part. It's gorgeous. Mm. Thinking, are we going to need all of this straw? Uh, probably. I would say we could swap it. Might be worthwhile swapping. What does everybody think? Should we swap it? That'd be a good idea. But then, that hasn't really finished. You know, we get some of these bales done, then go sort the cows out with some water and food. Obviously we need a bale trailer. Happy I've got some more dirty bean water. I'm happy. Okay, harvest oh, is nearly full, are you? Okay. I think swapping would probably be better. Here, I'll load you here via a 
wind rower, wind row the rest. Don't roll. So we do have the old Minneapolis Moline. Uh, what kind of horsepower does our little Minneapolis Moline have? That's the thing. Get that out in the old field. 50 horsepower. Is there actually a windrower that's 50 horsepower? Uh, 20, 100, 35, 35, 80. Really? 80 horsepower for that? Wow. 140, 90, 100. Jeez. Could get this and just use the big boy. But are we really going to need anything that big? I don't think we are. Uh, Sazmas, we'll get you. You'll do the job. But uh, we're going to need... Hmm. Got the two big boys. Got the two small tractors. I think we need another tractor. We've got mini. That's just to literally haul stuff around. So let's have a little look at tractors. This is the Z25. You're not really going to be of any use. Bureau? 100. Um. About you, 130. That's yeah, too new. About you, 120. 96. How much horsepower is actually needed for that swather again? What wind rower should I say? We brought that. We need 80 horsepower. So, medium tractors. What have we got in here? Oh, just that Ford with the missing wheels. Which is silly. Uh, could go for that. Do you know what? Let's go for that. Actually, no, 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 we will get a front loader attacher for you, just in case. Uh, quickie. Or oh, how? Quickie will do. I uh, do want. Whites. Yeah. I don't know, though, that's a lot of money for a tractor. Hmm. Standards and I'll have power. So now we need a where are you, skid steer front loader? Power. One twenty to one eighty. You think it's been a while since I've been on this. Okay. Um, that's going to be easier. Bag lifter. You. Just spikes are going to be just damn right easier, aren't they? Bell spike. Uh, do you know what we'll have? You, because you can stab the bales, can't you? Can you? We'll have that. Screw it, that'll do. That'll stab the bales. Just make life a lot easier, won't it? I 
probably never going to use the Minneapolis Moline, I shouldn't think, or just to cart stuff around, but other than that, we've got the truck, we can throw some bales in, and you're, wow, you're full already? Uh, okay. There's, uh, vast. Let's actually drive down there. Do love the gear change. Gotta love the gear shift. Out of the way, birds. Here we go. In the old John Deere. This is going to be full again. <coughs> so, well, we're getting a fair amount off this field. I've got to say, it is a fair sized field. We're not doing it with massively. Uh, massive equipment which I absolutely love that fact if you know me for a while now you know I love the old machinery mm. Mm. that international though oh international like I say though we are going to be getting a Ford tomorrow hopefully Fingers crossed. How are we doing to fill capacity wise? Geez, still got 40 odd percent left. Okay. Let's go. This is going to be a good harvest. We do need to get some cow sores, I do need to get some grass cut, get it tedded. Wiggle, wiggle, get in there. There we go. Get that emptied. Yeah. Jeez, I was wobbly bobbins there, wasn't I? Crack on. Tell you what, I'll actually park you here. And let's jump into you. I'm actually amazed I still remember some of the buttons. How cool is that? I 
think that is brilliant. Whoever comes up with these kinds of equipment need a massive pat on the back. Just amazing. Uh, Ricky, big fat thumbs up, buddy. How are you doing, mate? How are you doing? Hope you're doing all right. How's your day been? Your itches. Oh, did I tell you? Wearing a headset oh, does not make your ears sweat. I don't know how people can have them on all day. Oh, don't know how to do it. If you say earbuds, it'd be easier. Just the short fat man's broke. I mean, I brought these things when they were brand new. Uh, when they first came out, there. Uh, PS4 gold headset. Never buying them again, that's for sure. Bloody things. Issue after issue. Mm -mm. Okay, looks like he's doing alright. So when people watch Farm Sim, what's everybody's favourite part of it? Wow, made an absolute hash jab of that turn, didn't it? Hash jab? Jeez, I'm telling you, my English today. It's dreadful. I don't know what's going on. I can't speak the English. I'm bad. Oh. Really poor. One of these days, I'll be a big boy now and uh, get my words out. Maybe. He says. We know it's not happening. I'm gonna just learn to wipe my own ass. Productions! Yeah, we've got productions we can look at. Uh, there is a beer mod where we could also look at doing beer. <laughs> uh, hi, Margaret. How you doing? Big fat thumbs up. Hope you and Rev are doing well. <laughs> yeah, what kind of productions? Oh, shit. My driving sucks. I say there are brewery mods. The harvester almost has a full grain tank. Great. It's just doing well. Sugar. Oh, jeez, you are kidding, aren't you? Sugar cane. That's it, you're, you're seriously trying to put me in it. Bloody sugar cane. We haven't got any of the equipment for sugar cane. Uh, how am I feeling? I am feeling really good. Still got the occasional sniffle and sore throat and that, but other than that, I'm not too bad. Can you do some flowers? I suppose we could do some flowers, we just need to buy another header for the harvester, but yeah, we could do some flowers. <laughs> Are you really wanting living sugar cane? 
You alright, Jim? Rev there, how you doing, buddy? Hope you're alright. Thanks so much for sharing, truly do appreciate it. Let's get wobbly bobbins. Let's mix these to get out of my way, tree. What we'll do is we will pull this one further in. Uh, cloths made from sheep's wool. Yeah. But then we haven't got anything at the minute for sheep. Uh, we've not got any food for the sheep or nothing. We'd have to work towards it. I mean, we're going to be getting 15 cows and we've not even got anything for the cows yet. We ain't even got the cows yet, so... We'll get there. Sure we will. He says. But yeah, we can do some flowers. We can definitely do some flowers. Uh, close from the sheep wall. Yeah. If you want us to get sheep as well, we can do. But if we start having sheep and cows uh, at the minute, the finances are going to look a little bit dreary. I mean, we, sh we could sell the Mia Minneapolis Moline because that is just ridiculously loud. Well, we do need to get you a Ford. So let's just turn the engine off for a second. Um, where are you now? Where did I put it? I put it over there, didn't I? Put it over here. It's over there. Don't panic, everyone. Don't panic. Shh. I knew you was panicking. Shut up. Stop it. Where are you? You're all the way down. Oh God, you would be down that end, wouldn't you? I'm telling you. They're just like being far away from me. That's what it is. Right, you're over there. Are oh, you actually on the right side this time? Okay. Tell you what, though, I do like this John Deere. It is nice. Open cab. Normally, I wouldn't pick it. I wouldn't pick this class trainer either. I wouldn't have picked Baylor either. It's actually a pretty nice trailer, well detailed, I've got to say. But with it being base game trailer, I mean, it should look really, it really. Margaret there with a share. Big fat thumbs up, Margaret. Thank you very much. I truly do appreciate that. <coughs> How's the weather been over there, anyway? How's the weather been? Has it been hot? If it has, I'm jealous. Give me some of your sunshine. It's been bleeding horrible over here. Stay there, you're fine, you're emptying. I'm busy doing a job. Mm. Yummy. Got a lot of some dirty bean water. Mm-mm-mm. Damn your dirty bean water's way to go. <clears throat> Can't remember where I got that same from. Can't for the life of me remember. Hmm. I'm gonna bring this line over. The hot during the day, cool at night. Well, I hope you're keeping warm. Uh, I hope that heater that you've got. Is A stream you watch on YouTube. Uh, what? Sorry, I don't get what you mean from that one. Oh yeah, from yeah, from someone I watch on YouTube. Yeah, that was it. I can't remember who it was, but that was years ago, and ever since I've just said dirty bean water. 
yeah. Yeah, yeah. Took me a while to click on there, didn't it? Telling you. Getting old, losing my mind. I say the mind's the first thing to go. I'm living proof. Right, let's just stop this, because I know it's going to try and fling it all over the place. Honestly, I can't remember who it was I watched that used to say that. Hmm. Can't freaking remember. It's one of them things where you know it's on the tip of your tongue and you're like, uh, Hey, it's Rev, we are living at a campground now. Nice. And yeah, uh, everybody, uh, if you do see my name pop up, it's because uh, Rev's having to use his phone right now. And his phone does like being weird. It doesn't like letting him switch accounts from mine to his and things like that. Yeah. So if you ever see that, <laughs> and I'm live, then you know it's not me. It is Rev Simulation. Really does suck not being able to play uh, the games with you, Rev. I'm telling you. Oh, absolutely sucks. Uh, forgetting something when you have a lot to concentrate on at once, it's nothing to do with your mind. Go, well, what is that, I suppose? That's the pose. Uh, actually, they would be alright like that. Let's start windrowing these sides. How's the harvester getting on? Oh, he's got loads of time left there. Loads of time, nothing to worry about. And I've seriously parked that tractor and trailer right in the way. Good going, Mr. P, you're smart. I'm telling you, sometimes I amaze myself. I know I'm coming this way to do the wind growing, and I park there. Uh, yeah. right, let's quickly sort that, shall we? Swing around. There we are. There we go. <coughs> go. So, what's the weather been like where everyone is today? Here, it's pretty much rained all day. Literally all day. All it's done is rain. That's it. Just rain. Rain, 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 and more damn rain. It's annoying. It's like you want to get so much done, but you can't, because the wind has been really terrible over here. Uh, it's broken parts of the fence down, as I've said, um, it's broken, you know, the fence, part of the shed roof out the back. But there's nothing you can do, because it's just raining constantly. It's windy constantly. Sunny, 83 degrees, lovely. Oh, I wish it was here. You know, couldn't it sucks. Uh, I miss playing as well as soon as we can afford to get... Uh, get the camper, I'll be back up and running, but until then, it sucks. Yeah, it, it, it honestly, it just feels weird. I was talking to a walker the other day about it. And now uh, it, ju it just feels weird. Just, you know, it just does. It feels really weird. You know, you get that use, you know, streaming with yourself and uh, walker, Seba. 
and then you know with everything going tits up everything getting crazy and everybody getting busy it's like you struggle to find time and it's like it's so much you want to do but not enough time to do it Yeah, definitely doesn't feel the same streaming without you, that's for sure. Just really weird. You know, and talking to you every day as well. I'm not used to the not talking to you, that's because like, I got used to, you know, having to talk in with Rev Simulation every day. Every day we'd be on the phone. And it's just really weird. You get used to something and then all of a sudden it's like plateaus. It's very, very weird. I had to look twice then, I thought that tractor was moving, sliding, well, sliding forward, is it? No. That's what makes it that much more enjoyable though, finding time, appreciate it more. Exactly. That's the truth, that's the truth. Don't hit that bale. Don't drive over that bale. Don't drive over, you've driven over that friggin' bale, you moron. Seriously. Just had to. Just save it a moment. There's always one. Get out of it, straighten yourself out, you absolute idiot. Jeez. There. Idiot. Itchy nose. Uh, how are we getting on? That's that should be fine. Just move out of the way for now then. And to get this bailed up. That's weird with a three point hitch there and that com coming down. But, okay. Uh, the harvest. Uh, how are you doing? Let's have a look at what your levels are at quickly. That's uh, 67. Okay, you're fine. Uh, let's get the old uh, bales going again. Did I really need to buy another tractor? I could have used that. Could have used this. It's got enough power. But I want another tractor. You can never have enough tractors. Shh. Just accept it, move on. There we go. Here you go, that's a bit weird, isn't he? You know the old gear lever ain't there, mate, yeah? He thinks the gear lever's there, we'll leave him to it. We'll, we'll let him believe it. So what game rev do you miss the most? Or do you just miss all of them? I mean, it, it, it's got to be weird, because like, when my PC went down, you get that used to streaming and making content and all that, then all of a sudden it's 
flatlined, you can't do nothing. And it comes to night time or the afternoon and you're like, oh well no, I can stream now, and then you're like, ah, wait, I can't. It's a mat it feels like someone's literally just ran up and kicked you in the spuds. It sucks. Because you really do get used to doing it. And then when you can't. Uh, I miss you guys playing Spider Beat, LML. Yeah. Uh, currently, I play it with uh, Warco uh, Dutch every now and again. Uh, yeah, so that's quite a bitch. I don't know how I've come up with these names, but. Yeah. Stop, 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 stop. Jeez, this is a big swath. Damn, it's a big swath. Damn. Gonna get a couple of bales just down this swath. Very far. <laughs> <coughs> no idea. Harvest the where I. Oh, you're full. Uh, give me a second. We will just quickly, whilst we're here, go and empty out this harvester. Getting a lot done. Getting a lot done. This is going to be another full trailer full. So many great tyres, there needs to be more hours in a day. Did you ever find out why stuff wouldn't load? I have no idea. Um, maybe because of the recent update that they had. Uh, both Warco and myself. Uh, had loading errors with the game. It'd get all the way up to 99% on the loading bar and then just freeze. And he said to me, he goes, uh, Pete, I'm like, what, what's up, buddy? He goes, uh, it's on the loading screen. It's literally just crashed. It froze completely. I'm like, okay, so uh, I loaded it up and it did the same thing with me. And I mean, my PC is Frankenstein's monster. There is no way in heck that my PC shouldn't run it. I mean, all the games my PC can run, I mean... You should never struggle with that game. Never. But yeah, it wouldn't load at all. Got to 99... well, it would load, it got 99% and then just plateaued, just crashed. So it's got to have been due to the uh, most recent update for it. Which, uh, sucks. Hopefully it works next time, I hope so, because, you know, me and Walko, we, we do enjoy playing that game. It's a good game. Um, you know, some of the games that we used to play, you know, uh, there's issues with them that, you know, stop us playing them until a fix has come out. Yeah, I really do hope it works next time. I mean, there's uh, a couple of other games that we want to play, but, you know, we've done a lot of research and everything, and it turns out that there are issues with some of those games. So, you know, we have to put them on the back burner until fixes, patches, and, and things like that are brought out for the games. That's why some of the games that you've seen us play, the, that we've, like, stopped, it's because there are bugs in the game. 
and uh, we're waiting for those issues to be fixed. Annoying, but if a game's got issues, like major issues, like not loading, then what can you do? I don't want to walk too far. Uh, there's something wrong with Freddy too. Uh, no, I was waiting for the update, and the update is now available. I was literally just waiting for the update. I think the update was yesterday. I do believe it. The update was either today or yesterday. There was an update. Because there were like visual glitches. Uh, there was ways that people could cheat the system by going through invisible walls and invisible doors to get to certain areas and I don't want to accidentally do something wrong and it like cheat and people say oh well you know well, you cheated so I'd sooner wait for the the, Moses, the patch to come out and uh, so you can't do that but yeah uh, either yesterday or today that came out I believe or this week yeah, there was a recent update for uh, Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach, which will be coming back to the channel. I do believe, if I remember rightly, uh, I need to go underneath the main stage to get something for Freddy, if I remember correctly. Tomorrow, fingers crossed, I think I'm going to be streaming with Warco. Uh, I'm not sure. Depends, you know, real life and things like that. I think we should be streaming together. Wow, I'm getting a lot of bales just down this one row. This is a really handy baler, I do like this baler. I think it was, what is it, 40 or 45 horsepower this baler requires? It's not bad. Yeah, Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach will be coming back. Your family is looking for you. Yeah, I can remember that. Gonna keep fucking looking. Yeah. That's the thing, you know, I play scary games. But to me, they're not really that scary, because I make them funny. You know, that's, that's just the way I am. It's like Spider Beach. And, I mean, there are a lot of horror games that I want to get. It's just, financially, you know, I, I can't. It's not feasible. Since I've uh, been doing horrors and I've been doing uh, things with Walko, I'll message Walko, uh, Walko Entertainment, and I've actually got him into horror games and thriller games. So he'll message me, oh, you know, Mr. P, I found this game, what do you think to this? And I'm like, like big kids. The sleepers are cool too. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. It looks like the harvest is getting pretty full over there.
gonna say the game I like playing. I like playing GTFO, but uh, but but the bots, the AI that help well helps you. Ah, oh, dreadful. They are constantly making mistakes and causing you to get caught or, or things like that. But every time we play it, we do advance, we do get further, and it's really good. What's everybody's favourite game that I've been streaming so far? I mean, I know I've streamed a fair few, but what's everybody's favourite game that I they think I stream? I'd like to know all yours' opinions. What you think the best game is that I stream? Stuffed is one of them. Uh, probably American Truck Sim. That's another one. And the one with the robots. If I had to have a guess. You'll have to let me know if I'm wrong. Just as I say that, he's literally just stopped. Stuffed, ATS and Freddy, Transformers, is right up there. Oh, right, okay. So five Nights of Freddy's security breach is there, okay. Maui, leave her alone. Lay down. Mm-hmm. Tended to jump up there to sleep. You go up there to wind her up, leave her alone. The position he's just run and jumped on the set sofa in. He's literally jumped up, he sat down and just flopped his head around, he's like that. Like You amaze me, Captain telling you. You make me laugh. With his cat up in no. But I got two of well technically I got three right because I know you did like that other one. But yeah, five nights at Freddy's security breach. I oh jeez, I'm itchy. Uh, I didn't think that was it. Yeah, I didn't just didn't think of that one. Maui, leave her alone. Go to sleep. You always tell you're not looking and you'll edge and edge and edge. Sneaky little bugger he is. Absolutely sneaky. When he thinks you're not looking. So I love him the bits though. He's a pain in the back end. But he is a beautiful cat. Pure grey. I've had him chipped so he's gonna if anyone tries to take him, I know where he is. Pure grey. And my other one, Orion. Is pure tortoise shell, which is uh, yeah, nice. Uh, bot popped out with a map. Scared you? Uh... Oh jeez, yeah, I can remember that. 
When that bot popped out. Take a map, 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 take a map. Oh, jeez. Yeah, well, I was not expecting that. Turn the corner and all of a sudden that bot just pops out of nowhere with a map. Jeez. That was something else, that was. That really was. I'm thinking I'm going to get far too many bales. Let's check how many bales. Not you. Wait there, what equipment? Oh, what's the much? Not bad. Uh, we've got 34 bales. We're still going to get a fair few from this. Hmm. Yeah, you are right. That the bot offering a map did get me more. <laughs> <coughs> Hopefully, if I have time next week, I will stream uh, Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach again. And now that there has been the update. sitting like a mile back. This feels weird. Obviously you're fine. But honestly, I don't know if we'll need all the rest of the straw. I'm not sure. Hmm. I don't route, you know. Sexy tractor, if ever I've seen one. On point. Here we go. Get that off the touch. So, uh, Rev, if you're still watching, how long have you been at the uh, the campground now? Some dirty beam water, especially in the morning. You wake up groggy as shit. You feel like you've got ten, ten bags of sand in your eyes. You're like that. Like Morocco Mole. Anyone remember that cartoon? 
literally. Like, you like it's like you're a mole and you've just popped your head out the dirt. You're like, oh, nothing worse. It's like I've got sleeping me out. This field's taking a pretty long time. Been swimming for two hours and 43 minutes. Oh. We've not even got the first field done. But the thing is, we're harvesting it, we're swathing, we're windrowing, and we're baling. And we're, you know, we're loading up, obviously, the crop in the silo so we are getting a lot done technically wooden field turnover eh. does it feel like it? not really Wobbly bobbins, straighten out. I bet that. Oh, gee, look at that. Oh, oh. Harvester hasn't stopped, does it? No. Thought the harvester stopped. I was like, wait, what? What's it stop for? Nothing full. Get moving. I do like this track though. Hi. Mm. Hi. Yep, yep, don't ask. I don't know either. I have no idea. That's got a turning circle and a half on it, that harvest there. It turns pretty quick. actually got the point he hasn't left it a little bit that does surprise me I'm hoping I do not clip the harvester oh, it's gonna be close Nowhere near! Fuck off! Wimp. And when you play FS, people tend to talk more in chat. Uh, majority of the time, I think that's good. But the other games, they talk about that game, you know? Yeah. Yeah, I do agree. I do agree. He's just trying to find that niche that everybody likes. It's like there's so many games. I personally would want to play, but what do the people want to watch them? I don't know. Like at the end of the day, though, you know, like I've said from the start, I play games I like. Some people might not like them, but you know that's fine. Not everybody has to like the games I play. Not everybody has great taste. No, I'm joking. Um, not everybody, you know, has my style, sense of tasting games and that's that's totally understandable you know somebody's gonna get butt hurt now aren't they they're gonna go did you hear what mr p said it really fucking mean he said i got no fucking taste in games <laughs> you do get people that get butt hurt so easy and that's the thing you know when 
Seriously, I was literally just about to go over there. You get people that, you know, will try to slander you and all this, that and the other in as many ways as they can, you know, but do not bother me in the slightest. Uh, the variety is good though, people get bored of just one game every day. Yeah, it's, it's, it all depends though in if that's what people know your channel for. Because when I fir very first started, uh, my channel was literally about farming simulator. Literally just farming simulator. Uh, then they added FIFA and, you know, varied it. Uh, you need to stop for a second. I want you to stop being an idiot and go down there. There we go, straighten it out. I do see what you mean though, you know, variety, mix it up. Because, and the weird thing is, when I literally just used to do farm sim, I got burnt out on it because you're doing it all the time, every day. Because I was doing it as making videos rather than live stream, and I was literally recording the videos. Um, yeah, it, it just makes it that much more. Yeah. When, obviously, when you're making it as videos, um, you ch sometimes you can try and record them in bulk. So you'll record like a fair few hours worth to make at least like three or four episodes. And you do get burnt out on it real quick because people see the episode you know, a day or every other day. But when you record some of them, you're recording them in like bulk. And to try and keep up with the demand of the game, obviously, and what you're doing, because people want to go, oh wow, you know, oh, when's your next one? I can definitely understand people who know when you're channel for FS, because I usually got it. I usually got more likes and more content and subscribe. Yeah. Mm hmm. Yep. But, you know, and then I started doing other games because I wanted to differentiate my channel. And I did actually lose a couple of people because I wasn't just doing farm sim. And, you know, I'm not going to be to everybody's taste. Not everybody's going to want to watch everything that I do. I get that. I mean, I know. I'm the same. We all do it. You think, well, I don't really want to watch them play that. It's understandable. I get it. I mean, there are a fair few YouTubers that I know have now differentiated and rather than just you know go playing the one game that their channel's known for, they're 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 going around that. Like, like for instance, Seba, uh, Warco, very good friends of mine. They differentiate now. Uh, you got Seba doing the rally and you know, bringing other things to the channel. The same as Warco Entertainment. He does uh, horror games with me, adventure games with me. Uh, he's doing his uh, nautical series. Um, he's bringing so much more to his channel as well, which is fantastic. You know, he's differentiating. He's bringing more people in for that factor. So, you know, and I hope it all works out for them because they both deserve praise for what they do because they both put in amazing effort for their content. They are truly great people. You know, people think, oh, you know, just because... I make content, you know, I'm a, 
odds with them, you know, mine has to be better and all this, that and the other. No, it doesn't. You know, I want them to do well. I mean, I want. I mean, right now, you know, I'm. I keep messaging uh, Orko. You know, when some of his episodes coming out, I'm like, when's this coming out? You know, I want to watch it. Or, um, or the same as sort of like Seba, when his David and John series is coming out. I love watching that. Uh, I love watching his Down on the Farm series. And the weird thing is, I love watching. You know. Because uh, behind the scenes, you know, as you know, uh, if you watch Seba's uh, Down on the Farm series, I'm actually one of the voices for one of his characters. And I still love, because I don't know what, you know, I, I just get given voice lines. And I'm like, well, wait a minute, how's he going to implement that? And then he makes the series, he puts it all together, he throws it all in, and he, he does a fantastic job. Kudos to him. They all do amazing. But then again, your channel isn't just about the variety of games. Everyone talks, laughs, general interaction in general. Exactly. I mean, I'm not one of these people that are just going to sit there and go, Why? I will interact with every single person. I mean, you saw, um, I think it was a few months ago now, I had a couple of um, trolls come in on YouTube, literally trying to slag me off. And I think I hurt their feelings more than they hurt mine, because they just didn't hurt my feelings whatsoever, I mean... You can't insult somebody that insults themselves on live streaming, I mean... It's like looking at a guy that sat there eating an ice cream and saying, You're eating an ice cream, you are. Well, yeah. I mean... What more do you expect? Uh, Dong. Yeah. Show me Dong, Lord Dong, King Dong, and it's like... Okay. Each to their own. Yeah, there's like, oh, you're short. And I'm like, yeah, I'm the short fat man. But you're fat. Oh, well, yeah, I call myself the short fat man. Yeah, but you're fat. Do you not understand? I call myself the short fat man. It's not a metaphor. I'm short and I'm fat. I mean... <laughs> Duh! Oh, jeez. It's like the people try to insult me, and it's like, really? Have you... Do you watch my streams? Obviously, fucking not. You know, that shit just does not bother me at all. I mean, I think I hurt their little feelers. Um, they, didn't come back, they didn't come back in the next stream. I'm really upset about that. They didn't come back, you know. I thought we had something special and they didn't come back. I think I hurt the feelings. Honestly, I literally think they did get butt hurt. And because I didn't react the way they thought I would, I was literally just ripping them worse than they was ripping me. I don't think they liked it. Uh, I'm awake. Hello, Stephen. Wakey wakey. Uh, but you're not fat. I know, but I'm not exactly short either. Well, I am short, fuck it. I'm, just lying. I'm kidding to you, I'm lying. I'm short, I'm short, I'm short I'm fat. The short fat man. Well, honestly, no, I'm not really fat. I'm just, I'm just short. Like, extremely short. Hi! <laughs> yeah, did you actually fall asleep there, Stephen? I think somebody fell asleep. Oh. 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 Crow. Yeah, but honestly though, I thought that was really funny, you know. People trying to come onto my YouTube and uh, insult me. I insult myself. Uh, uh, Corey, big fat thumbs up, buddy. I thought you fell off the planet. Where have you been? I bet you've been like Superman. You've been in that tele uh, telephone box, throwing on the old Superman outfit. Your average height, your crumpet sized. <laughs> crumpet sized. Uh, Stephen, yes, I did. How dare you? Watching you, telling you. <laughs> so I hope you're doing well, Corey. Hope you're doing all right, buddy.
Did I lift that up? Yes, I did. Wow, that actually amazes me. Normally, I forget. Uh, did I? Yeah, I did. Okay. Got to the end of this line and then I turned and stopped. I've amazed myself. Because we should be fair. Honestly, though, when people come in my streams, you know, try to troll me and insult me. Oh dear. It's funny. <laughs> you would have thought, you know, pay attention. <laughs> uh, I'm doing okay. How are you making it? I am doing alright, buddy. I'm glad to hear you are doing okay. Uh, I was uh, getting worried. I was going to message you yesterday, but it's just been horrendous. It's like everybody. It's like I am the wise word for everybody. It's like I'm everybody's guru. When they have problems, come to me. Hey, hello. Start charging per the hour. No, I'm joking. You know, I try to help everybody. But uh, I was going to call you yesterday, but I just, I just got too busy. It's like, oh, jeez. And by the time, you know, I had a little bit of time, it was just, just too late. It's like, no, nah, I can't. I've got to get some sleep. Got to get some sleep. My back itches. Oh, it's better. So we've been up too late with then Corey. Are getting a bit high on this track, ain't it? 0 0.8 already on it. Oh, it's a gorgeous tractor. Mm. Gotta love this tractor. Oh, you will be able to be right near the edge, wouldn't you? Sexy screenshot. Right, just check, make sure that I'm not having any latency issues. Nope. Next change. Go forward. What is that? Ooh. I'm going to get a lot of bales. Cameron sliding in there. Big fat thumbs up, Cameron. How you doing, buddy? And uh, what have we got? Uh, how old were you when you started playing FS? Jeez. I think uh, the first one I played was 09. Um, but I didn't play it for long. Uh, the one I really got into when I was able to actually start, you know, taking pride in FS was FS15, because uh, at that time, you know, I was old enough to realise that, you know, you actually need to do jobs rather than just drive around, you know. But yeah, I'd just say FS15 was when I started taking it seriously and actually enjoying it for what it was rather than just driving random machinery. And uh, I'm 34. 35 next year, next month. I know, right? 35 next month. Oh, feel old. 35. Oh. oh. 17 was awesome. 17 was, yeah. Uh, when I initially went from 15 to 17, it was a massive change to me visually it was a massive change and it's like wow it changed for the better but there was that many issues when that first came out then when 19 came out there were so many issues when that first came out 
I loved 17. Um, i trying to think. Sussex Farm on 17 was the first map I played. Sussex Farm. Oh, no. The first modded map I played was Sussex Farm. If you want to know all about FS15 and Rev Simulations, your man, because he absolutely loved 15. And I still think he did actually, every now and again, he would actually still stream 15, I believe. For a bit of nostalgia there, Rev Simulation was streaming 15 for a while. That's the first touch. So which one do you think's got your attention the most then, Cameron? 15, 17, 19? Because if you're like me, you know, you, you played it for a fair few years. You, you, you see the massive difference from then to now. It is just immense how dramatically it's changed for the better. But you think about it though, from then to now, the crops really haven't changed, have they, if you think about it. All this time, and, the, I mean, Giant's farming simulator itself is a massive European name on its own now. You would have thought they would have been able to add more crops, you know what I mean? It's like, oh yeah, for 19 we've added some new crops that were already modded crops in 19. Are they new though? New to base game, yeah. Well, they're not exactly new. Sorghum. That was initially a mod. Um, olives. Grapes. That was a mod. The broad to harvest the grapes. That was a mod. And then to go, oh, from 19 to 22, we brought in grapes, but guess what? You've got the same machinery and the same harvester, yes! We've listened to you. Well, no, you haven't. Really, have you? I live in Great Britain. I live in England. We do a lot of cauliflower, cabbage, carrots, um, and things like that. And over here, we don't just have grimmer for potatoes. I mean, there's a lot of other machinery that you can use for potatoes that is self-driving. I do know that every now and again, they don't really bring out a lot of American stuff, do they? kind of weird and they never bring out a vintage equipment DLC either do they they're like oh we've listened to the fan base uh, do you check your social media the amount of people that use vintage equipment compared to the new equipment is immense I mean like as you know Cameron you look on the social media posts and sites and pages it's pretty much all people using vintage equipment. Nine times out of ten, it is people using vintage equipment. Like this. <laughs> and this. And it takes modders to make them. And modders, honestly, they really don't get the appreciation they deserve from giants. I'd never be able to be a giant's partner. I never would, because I slag them off too much. I'm just being honest, I just do. I slag them off far too much. In fact, I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. If it's an issue, it's a fucking issue. I was going to say, is it not unloading? What are you doing? 
Unload. Unload. <laughs> oh dear, I'm telling you. One of these days, I will be a big boy. Uh, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Is it sliding? Shh, stop. That was weird. Hello, uh, really there. Hi! Hello, Ridley. <laughs> How you doing, buddy? Welcome back. I'm... You've got a lovely pair of coconuts. Let's... Till this is already put in 2.5 oh 2.5 hours. Oh you little beastie you. Tell you what, we've been streaming now for three hours and uh, nine minutes, and I've not even got this fucking field finished. But what you got to remember is I'm not just harvesting it; I'm also swathing it. I'm also windrowing it. I'm also baling it. Let's straighten it out. If I can. You watch, this will probably be the shittiest straight line you've ever seen in your life. But it's my straight line. I'm proud of it. I call it my own. that bale before I forget about it. I know there's another one over there as well. Yeah, there. I'm getting there, Ridley, look. Getting there. Only this little bit left and that dinky little piece over there. And I would have done it. Ta-da! How many people do you know that would do a live stream with this kind of machinery? With a field this big? Probably not many. For me, I love old machinery. I don't care. I enjoy it. And that's the whole point of streaming. Do what you enjoy. If you don't enjoy it, then why are you doing it? Once you lose the fun, there's no, no, there's no point in doing it if you don't find the fun in it. Right, there we go, so that should be the straight er line. Ish. Kind of, maybe. He says. It's probably the worst straight line you have ever seen in your life. But like I said, I'm proud of it. It's my straight line. What can I say except you're welcome? My lines are about as straight as a circle. Yes, they are that precise. Big boy, I can do a straight line. Look at this, are you ready? Hey, fuck me, that's pretty straight. Hey? 
It just goes down a bit, you know, we're on an incline. <clears throat> oh dear. You see that? It's like Harry Potter, it just pops on. Oh, you. That's one button. Whoops. There we go. Chug, chug, chugging, chugging along. Some bales, take them over to the cows. Uh, I think we're going to have to buy some hay bales for now. Makes me sad. And 13 minutes. Wow. Thanks, guys, Stephen. Truly do appreciate that, buddy. Truly do appreciate that. Definitely helps me out. Wow, we've already put 0 0.9 hours on this track now. There the old girl's got it going on. Look, the old in uh, international. moving parts. Still waking up. Jeez, I'm just glad you slept, buddy, because I know that you haven't been sleeping very well lately. Add an itch under my chin, alright? Don't judge me. Uh, I will actually get these lines here. But yeah, I know you haven't been sleeping very well lately, buddy. And I'm just glad you've uh, managed to get some sleep. I know it can't be easy, you know, when you've got a lot on your mind. Exactly. Yeah, it ain't easy, buddy. It ain't easy. But I think you're doing alright, buddy. You're doing alright. Keep it up, mate. Best thing to do is be yourself. Keep your head up. Easier said than done at times, I get that, but... <laughs> Everybody is always their own worst enemy. And your own worst critic is yourself. But it's moving, it's because my tractor was sliding. Weird. So tomorrow we uh, I will be looking to see if I can get some more Ford mods. I know they're out there, I know I've had some before. There is no faking it till you make it either. And uh, there is try till you make it, exactly. 
there is no such thing as can't. There's such thing as give up. Hey, you're supposed to... No, you can't do it if you don't try. The only failure is not trying. So what I think we're going to do, we're going to get the truck, we're going to load up a uh, couple of straw bales. Um, I've been asked for 15 cows, so we're going to get the 15 cows. I'm not sure exactly how much that's going to cost, but it is what it is. Uh, let's get in the old truck. it look like oh okay speedo works okay there we are uh is there there we go oh, I don't like auto save on but for some reason it is unfold wait what oh how cool is that to fold down and fold in. Ooh, I like that. Should we be doing it like this? No, but I'm going to for now. Just to get some of these bales on. Turn that off. Right, does anybody know if If you need to... Oh jeez, Harvester almost has a full grain tank. If you need a straw blower, or you can literally use loose straw for cows. Does anybody know? Ah, there we go. I was right with the right buttons. I was like, wait a minute, what? Eh? Eh? Uh, the animal pen, Stephen. Uh, are you able to use a straw bale? Or does it have to be a loose straw with a blower? If you don't know, that's fine. Just have to get the old straw blower, straw chopper, whatever people want to call them. Loose. Oh, okay. Uh, wait a minute, what's happened to... Why 
does this sound like the indicator's on? It's been so, since a while I've been so done animals. Ah, right, okay. So you are a handy bleeding truck though, isn't it, eh? Handy friggin' truck, I'm telling ya, I knew it would come in handy. Oh, what the heck happened there? Oh, can't get over that. So let's strap them all down. And let's look at that. Like it was meant to be. And the harvester is full. So let's just pull this over here. everybody think of the equipment I've got none of it is massive and I absolutely love that fact I'm getting it done with the small equipment very nice equipment I know right John Deere, John Deere, an old style truck, love it. Got the old, uh, <coughs> oh jeez, farm all over there, the old Massey with the uh, windrower and the bike case baler, love it. Love that old vintage equipment. Well, like I said, on social media, how many people do you see really use the new equipment? Really don't. You see people use all the vintage stuff. All the old style stuff. Right, so I've got more of this. And nothing like what you had. I love that purple truck. That was done for you on mining, I think it was. Oh my god, that was beautiful. Uh, the truck was, but I was able to do all the colours and everything, yeah. But it's public now, it's fine, it's alright. can always get it back. But on this series, I won't really need it. Because I've got all small equipment, it's not like the big mining stuff I have. Which I'm absolutely gutted about, I will have to try and get most of that back. Makes me sad. Where is the cows? There, so out here, turn left. There we go. So let's take these straws. Straw, these straws. Ding dong. Take these uh, straw. Uh, it'll be okay. Fresh starts are always good. You'll flow right through it. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, I know that. But the, the live stream stuff. But it's all the stuff that I had set up um, for the realistic series. I had spent weeks 
uh, making alterations to the map, getting things set up and having all auto drive courses set up and all things like that. Um, a lot of work behind the scenes with that. And uh, yeah, made me sad. So literally I've lost all of that, all the realistic series stuff as well. Uh, I was going to go pick these cows up, but I'm just going to get them from here for now. Uh, I want ones that produce the most milk, and that is the Holstein age 12 months, puberty 18 months. And 15, wasn't it? 15. There we go. 15 Holstein. It all should be... Yes, there. And where's... Get up, you lazy cow. Ah, where's your water point? I forgot already. I know the straw and all that's there. That is diesel. Uh, might as well buy some. I don't know. And uh, they should give you an option if you want to update or not. Oh no, the, the, the game would have to update anyway uh, to all the new things that they've implemented in and, and all that. You know, it's one of those things. That is cool, I like that. If I didn't drive into the wall. Next update, modern precision farming technologies will feature in the latest home simulator extension. Release new precision farming free extension on April the 19th. Get ready to make your... Oh, jeez. Honestly, I didn't like precision farming. I just did. Oh, jeez. I just didn't for some reason. Right, uh, I need a straw blower, you said, wasn't it? Yes. Let's get them in this way. So, animals. Punch. Uh, 90 horsepower for you. It's really not going to be any use. Scepter mix. Twenty hundred. Hmm. Ninety horsepower for eleven point nine. 90 horsepower for 30. Might as well use that Evo mix, haven't I? 
make more sense to get that. Because then at least we can use this as a scroll blower as well. Gonna need a tractor for it down here though. So... We're going to need a 90 horsepower tractor. Um... You'll do with the front loader. You only need 115 horsepower, standard wheels, trailer bolts will do. That'll do. Old style tractor. It's got the power for it. It's got always going to be over here with the cows, it's not going to move. Jeez, wow, that didn't give them a lot of bed in, did it? Holy shit, they take a lot of bed in. Eight. Okay, so one. Two. Tractor's going to be working over time. Oh. It, oh, there. Rogue bail, rogue bail alert. Here you go. Oh jeez, there. Uh, uh. All right, can anybody remember the cows' names? Hmm? Wow, that is going in really slow. I'm gonna buy a little bit of TMR for now, though. Three hours, 36 minutes. Thanks for that, Stephen. That truly does help, mate. That truly does help. What I'm going to do is I'm going to quickly turn my camera off, have a quick cigarette, and we will get uh, the rest of these cows sorted. Uh, Bessie, Bella. <sighs> Can you remember the others? I can't. <coughs> De oh dear, Deborah. <laughs> oh, jeez. Deborah's the stubborn one.
Dodge it, Deborah, we call her. Wait, what? Serious? What? Took all of that straw? Damn, yeah, you're gonna have to make do. Don't on your damn. Should turn that off a minute. Damn, that was a lot of straw. Uh. All right, so what is this for? I don't know what that's for. I have no idea. What is this for? Is that... Is that mineral feed? I don't know. We're about to find out. Let's have a look. Pallets. Big bags. Not you. Not you. Pallet, solid fertilizer, mineral feed. Are you it? I don't know. We're about to find out. Nope. Are you? Nope. You? Nope. You? Nope. nope. Is the mineral feed back around here? Or is mineral feed even accepted on this map? That's diesel. Oh shit! In 11, big platforms up, buddy. How are you doing? Hope you're doing well, my friend. You go here. You're not even accepting it. You suck. Got mineral feed for nothing. <laughs> You suck. So, what the heck is this for? Hmm. Is that to drop off their food? So what's that? I had to put the mineral feed in the trailer. What? Really? Oh god, they suck. Seriously, I'm gonna feed a trail. Hello there, man. You good? Just woke up, finally was able to catch you live. I know, right? How you doing? Can I get mineral feed in? Wait, 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 wait. I may be able to get mineral feed in here. Turn that out. Just turn around this way, shall we? Far quicker. Thank you. In you get. Really not a lot of mineral feed, is it? Jeez. Oh, jeez. There's always something. Come on, out of the way. So, uh, how's life been there, Eleven? Have it been doing you well? So, what's this say when I drive under it? Too far. <laughs> Can I empty this from the back? I can. Oh, nice. Uh, 
tip side. Back. Yeah, I haven't got a clue either. Because I don't know if Mineral Feed was brought out after this map. Or... Before this map. So I don't even know if this map's eligible. For Mineral Feed. We've been really busy in preparing something classic for our return in streaming. Oh, awesome! I really can't wait, buddy. I can't wait. I've missed you streaming, buddy. You and Seven. Yeah, it's not accepting it here, either. Renal feed is not accepted here. So you use the cheat to empty it out. Which is confusing. We'll share some teasers on our page soon, just need to do more editing. <gasps> oh, I can't wait! Honestly, I'm really excited to see it, buddy. <coughs> really excited to see that. Right, camera's back, burn your eyes. I know. Oh. Alright, let's sit there. Buy some stuff. Um Herbside, liquid fertilizer, sugarcane, seeds. Not you, big bags. Road salt, wheat, lime seeds. Hmm. I thought I could buy TMR. Obviously... I haven't got that mod installed. Okay, well... Fair enough. Uh, we'll have... Four hay bales. Yeah, really miss playing with you, Reverend Walker. Yeah, tell me about it. Uh, I was actually going to see if you're busy on Sunday. But you're, you're probably going to be busy, buddy. Bales next. So, bales, silage bales, four silage bales for now. Don't want to get too many this Sunday or next week, and uh, this Sunday coming. I was going to see if you want. Oh, jeez. 
you and Walko wanted to do a bit of uh, robot killing. Or tomorrow. Because I know me and Walko's uh, going to be doing it tomorrow. Total mix ration. Bring up the old chart. Bit of straw. Uh, do need to buy a straw bale then. I've got straw bales. One straw bale. Where are you? Where's my straw bale? There. Where the fuck is my straw bale there? Hey! Hey! Get. Shit, what's wrong with this straw bale? Get out! Hey, oh! There we go. Let's have a look. And. Is that going to take me over the mark? No, it's not. Okay. Uh, silage. And hay. So. One hay. One silage. One silage. One hay. I've never used this Robert one before, so I'm not sure what the total mix of this thing is. So hopefully this is all right. Okay. Let's have a look. No productivity. Milk. You're not giving any slurry. Um, TMR's going up, but how much does it take? Be right back, okie dokie. Wow, this tractor's really struggling with that. <laughs> good, good. Oh, hello. No one of the cows is coming around, look. Oh, hello. You know it's food time, don't you? You need your bath now. having some visitors here uh, tomorrow. It's like in your time, I can try to jump in since it'll be like Monday morning here. <laughs> um, I think it's going to, our time, it will be about 9, 9.30 at night. So it'll be like really early your time. Like really early. Right, so, one... In you get. And some straw. Jeez, I got straw bales. Up the old farm. Uh, right, let's grab this. It is all costing me money. I didn't really want to use it this way. But like I said, we just don't have TMR, but we will be making it as soon as we're able to. All right, so we need more. One more hay, one more silage. So. One more hay. One more silage. Should. Do it, he says. Right, where's that? Oh, jeez, there's that one. Over there. Over you go. Alright, silage. One more hay. Yeah, and that's taking the straw down, putting it up. Okay, that's brilliant. So we'll mix ration. There we go. One more straw bale here, so let's 
enough of that here. So we should be getting milk uh, at some point. Uh, let's have a look how they're doing. Uh, 38,196. That will be going up. <coughs> so that's all the TMR I am going to give them. Because all we've got right now is straw at our farm. You are fine. Do you not need water? Um, productivity. It says they don't need water. That is like really weird. What animals don't need picking water? Well, they fixed that glitch, didn't they? Birds able to fly through buildings, through walls. Oh, hello. The hell? Mm hmm. Yeah, that's exactly what I thought, Stephen. That's exactly what I thought. Uh, hmm. There's a new patch or update in Generation Zero yet? I haven't opened my Steam yet. <laughs> oh, new machines. It's new machines, 11. New machines. And they're a handful. Boy, are they a handful. Right, let's get back in. TF, exactly. <laughs> My thoughts. My thoughts, exactly. So I've got a lot of straw bales as you can see, but me thinking about it now, I am glad that I did get the harvest to literally to just drop the whole swath. We're going to need a lot of straw bales, and we've only got 15 cows. Oh, new machines to swing with my baseball bat. You're going to need more than the baseball bat for these ones, Eleven, I'm telling you. They, uh, they don't play nice. They really don't. I mean, if you check out my two previous streams, buddy, you'll see them in there. They are... A nightmare. Absolute nightmare. Right, how much has this got left? But yeah, I mean, if you can get close enough to it, you could probably swing the bat at it once. Possibly. <laughs> but it's like the harvester. It... It'll like shoot out this like poisonous gas if you get too close to it. So you literally just have to bombard it with rockets. Literally, you just gotta bombard it with that. You're definitely gonna need more than a bat. Bailers going. Um, let's get the swath going. Definitely gonna need more than a baseball bat. Be alright, but mate. Okie dokie, buddy. Okie dokie. No rushes. Freaking nose itches. Oh. 
Still got a lot of straw bales, which I'm really happy now we have got. Because I honestly thought that eight bales would be enough, and apparently it wasn't even enough to fill their bed in. Which is daunting, which means I'm glad we've got the grass fields that we've got. Uh, we do need to get that grass cut. Uh, we do need a, a tedder to turn the grass over. We need the hay. Ah, oh dear. What's it look like in here? Oh, beautiful. I love this tractor. Harvest there, just chugging along. We've already put 0.4 hours on this thing. Wow. When did you get that tractor? When you was asleep. We needed one for the windrower. Uh, bless the farmers, they really have hard work, so people everywhere can eat. I mean, imagine how to do all that every day, all day. Yeah. I mean, it's definitely got to be hard work, getting up early in the morning, going to bed early in the morning. Can't be easy. I mean, I'd love to be a farmer. I know it's hard work. I know it's hard work. It's definitely got to be hard work. With all the hours you put in, but I just love being outside in the tractors. I'd love it. I'd be, I'd be happier than a pig in shit. Alright, how's that? Oh, he's turning him round, okay. So there's just that little bit there, that little piece over there, and that will be this field done. The thing is, is this the biggest field? Three, six, yes it is. I don't know, field two is pretty darn big. We don't have any crops in there though. We do need to buy a planter uh, because we're going to be putting sunflowers in one of the fields. I could pitch you as a farmer. Uh, as long as the straw hat isn't involved. No, there'll be no straw hat. No. No straw hat. And no wheat in the mouth either. No. Unfortunately. Yeah, there won't be any of that. <coughs> but we need to get a cedar, we need to get a planter, and we've got the two big tractors now. So, some farmers aren't like that. Oh yeah, I know they're not, I know they're not. Um, we're just having a general laugh, but um, I would love it, I would. I mean, getting to wake up early in the morning, knowing that your hard work's paid off and you get to see all like all this kind of countryside I would absolutely relish it I really would I mean I'm one of those people that absolutely hates doing nothing absolutely hate doing nothing I really do I wonder how the harvest is going to react when it starts getting to this piece here down there. Huh. When I was growing up, I had a uh, uncle that was a farmer. But I think I remember you telling me that. I think I remember you telling me. Hmm. What what crops did he kind of grow? Uh, was it like wheat, corn, soybean? Because I know certain areas it's like corn, corn and bean counties, you know. Uh, others are like uh, spring wheat, winter wheat, and things like that, chickpeas. Just depends what, what kind of area you're in as to what the fertility of the ground's like, the weather, wheat and corn. Or 
Paulson. Let's go, how you doing? Harvester's doing it. I'll tell you what, that chucky little harvester, it's doing it. It is doing it. But what you got to remember as well, like I've said, we're not just harvesting the field. We're getting it swathed. We are windrowing it. We're baling it. We've now took some uh, bales over to the cows. We're also taking our crop into the silo. I mean, it's all... I'm trying to rotate it all, get it all done. I don't think I'm doing too bad. You know? Well, I don't think I'm doing too bad. probably make more sense to have this tractor over at the cows and that other one over here I don't know we'll see uh, where is that you're chugging along you're fine for now It's up to you, I know. I know we're going to be doing sunflowers. Uh, what would you like planted in one of the fields, Stephen? Obviously it has to be within reason on what we can do. We haven't got the means for potatoes, sugar beet, cotton, sugar cane, we just can't do those. Corn. Yeah, it seems like we just need a planter to start off then, so we can do corn and uh, sunflowers with a planter. Well, though, I definitely went through uh, more straw than I thought I would. Especially only need only have 15 cows. I mean, jeez. Okay. So let me write this down. Corn and sunflower. take a lot. Yeah, pigs take more. Jeez, oh, pigs. You didn't even get me started on damn pigs. It's like... Is it just me or does it just seem like you just don't really get a return on the pigs? Yeah, you can sell them. But with cows, you get milk. is nearly full, okay. Whilst you're doing that, let's just quickly go and uh, empty out that harvester. Well, four hours, seven minutes, jeez. trying to get this field done, that's what I'm trying to get done. I'll let him turn around. Reverse, reverse. Thank you.
they have never done pigs and the cows. Oh, pigs take a lot. And it just seems like you get like no return from them. So obviously I won't get all the bailing done, but I can get the bailing done off screen. I think the best thing you can do with pigs is like you said, sell them. Yeah, that's about it. Yeah, you get slurry, but you get slurry with cows. With cows you get milk. Milk is always a good seller. that we own there and over there. Hunts and the cows, I believe. Yeah, the best ones for milk are the Holstein. Uh, the best one for meat... Can't remember. Can't remember. I used to know. It's been a, been a hot minute, that's for sure. But I, knew that, I do know the Holsteins are the best ones for milk. The Angus burger, don't you, and all that, so that makes sense. expecting to be streaming this long. A lot of people have uh, actually, rather than just that, because they don't like the way 22 is, they've actually gone back to 19 and just stayed on 19. They just don't like 22. And yeah, don't get me wrong, 22 has its issues, but so did 19, really. But you do have to say there is a, a lot more out for 19 than there is 22, but that's understandable as well because 19 was out a heck of a lot longer.
so we'll be calling the stream uh, as soon as the harvester's got that side done I'll get that bit done off screen been going for a while Mr. P's starting to get sleepy So what map have you been playing on 19 then, Stephen? There were some good maps for 19, I've got to say, some real good maps. I now need to have, uh, possibly if I can tomorrow, um, just have a look around, see what I can find, see if I can find some good fords. I know they're out there because I've had them before finding the damn things. Stone Valley. Yeah. So what is it about Stone Valley? Is it just like a, the way it's set out or something like that? I think I have asked you before. Or is it because I, I think he was saying that it's, because it's near where you live? Think. Think that's what you were saying. It's facing the main line. I'm in Missouri. That was it. I was close. I like the layout also. I, uh, I like, um, I like Marwell Manor. I really do hope that comes out to, uh, 22. It'd be nice to see that map. Because it just reminds me of around here, how things are and the way farms are. I love it. Too bad. There's other ones see we do down on the farm. So, no. No. <coughs> no, unfortunately it isn't. Pies and the harvester. You know, one of these days, honestly, I will be able to talk. You know, it's not like doing live streams and I talk. Oh dear. One of these days. Well, I do love um, watching Zebras Down on the Farm series. I mean, the, the next one's going to be brilliant. Be 
you know, there has been little sneaky pictures that Seba's posted on his uh, YouTube channel. So, uh, uh, if you do like realistic roleplay series, go check him out. Awesome guy, awesome content. So you won't be disappointed. down here and I think we'll go out uh, and empty out the old uh, harvester. I think it's a must. Before it goes there. Uh, ah! It's sad uh, that it has to stop though. Is it though? Where? Oh, where did I put? Work as a full tank. I've known you've got a full tank. There we go. For now, I believe it has. I think you need to look again, uh, Stephen. Let's just say that. I may be wrong. I mean, don't get me wrong, I talked to Seba, but <laughs> I mean I may be wrong. But I may not be. There is a fourth series. Maybe. Maybe. done. i get the last bit done myself. Because I know that's going to cost a lot of money. Wow, we've got 3.7 hours on this thing already. We only just brought it. Ooh. And that's just in one field. Told you I'd do the field. Told you.
just want to get, like I said, just want to get this little bit done. Because I do have a busy day tomorrow. I've got to be up real early. And that sucks. Got to go, you know, as you do, got to go out and do all the uh, usuals. Sad. Got to go out and socialise. Oh dear. Never fun. But oh, geez, uh, 3.8 hours on this harvester. It's only done in one field. Doing me proud though, doing me proud, it's a beast. It will need a clean. I love the harvest, I love this thing, I love the old machinery. I'm gonna use this thing until until it literally falls apart. I'm really happy with the machinery that I've got. I knew I wanted this harvester, that's why I downloaded this modded harvest. Uh, but, you know, the style of header, uh, that John Deere there, the trailer. Um, I knew I wanted the Minneapolis Merlin, but I might get rid of that. That is just literally too loud. I uh, wish they would bring more old machines to console. Yeah, because you know, people think now because I play it on PC, I've, I've never played it on console. I don't know where people get that from. But I actually started on PS4, as you know, Stephen, you know. And the amount of times I used to say, I want to stay on console, I will not go to PC. The only reason I went to PC, basically, is because I was fed up with the issues with the PlayStation 4. I was constantly fed up with the issues with PlayStation 4. It was just so annoying. It was, like I say, it was taking me nearly six hours to seven hours to record one episode that would last about 20 minutes because my PlayStation just kept turning itself off and it just blue screening and all that jazz and it just got so annoying. I was like, enough's enough. I've got to do something. And then I just started thinking, get a PC, better my content and go that way. But I do agree, and the weirdest, the thing that I find the weirdest that I didn't like as a console player. As a console player, you pay more for the game. You literally pay more for the console version than you do the PC version, but yet you get less. How's that make sense? I understand poly counts and licensing because of Sony and, uh, and all that, but Xbox is owned by Microsoft. Windows is owned by Microsoft. How is it Xbox can't do the licensing thing like PC does? It's the, the, the same company. That I never understood. PlayStation 4, yeah, I get it. It's owned by Sony. I mean... But Xbox? It's owned by the same company that do Windows. Microsoft PC. So, what... I, I, I never understood that. That's the one thing I never got. Oh, we nearly got it. There's that bit there. I know there's that bit there. But that I can get done off screen. Just depends how much is over there. Actually, it might be worthwhile getting it done now. But I want them to bring vintage DLCs. Vintage equipment. Like the horses. Right now they're useless. 
They really are. They're useless. Give the horses a purpose. Let them pull a car. Let them pull a plow. What use is the horse? I mean, they used to use them in the olden days. Why can't you do that now? You've already got horses implemented in the game. You've already got plows implemented in the game. Just add a strap to the horse, or the back saddle to the horse, where you can attach a plow to. You've already got the things in place to be able to do it. That's what I never understood. I never understood that either. Oh yeah, that ain't, that's not a massive area, is it? That's not the tip -top. But I said, even when I was playing on PlayStation 4, as you know, Stephen, the amount of times I said, bring out old equipment on console, give us the ability to lease fields or, or rent to own, you know. There were so many things I wanted to see come to console, like follow me. That would be amazing on console. Follow me would be amazing on console. Oh. It really would. Because as a content creator, constantly going to have to go back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, just setting up. It's just tedious. I mean, loud. now, I've been harvesting this field for 4 hours and 31 minutes. Well, pretty much 4 hours. But you think, you watch this in one episode of a recorded video, you see about, what is it, 4 minutes, if that, of a little video highlights of the harvester like this, like that, zooming across. This field, in reality, has took about four hours to harvest. It takes a whole minute, that's for sure. It takes a whole minute. feel done. And the old girl doing me proud. I'm gonna get it over the four hour mark, that's for sure, this harvester. And that is real time. Three hours, nine minutes. Like, I don't understand why I can't have this harvester for console. Yeah, I, I don't understand that either. Uh, I don't know whether it's the the whole slot count issue again, or uh, the poly count of how this thing's made, I, I don't know. Oh, but this is a lovely harvester. It is the John Deere Side Hill 6600. Beautiful harvester. Well, you know me, I'm a sucker for old equipment. There is uh, definitely uh, certain machinery that I will no longer be getting. And everybody already knows all this. Even in cab, it looks gorgeous. Basic, and that's all you need. Uh, the Ford. Oh. I 
I don't think you, I think the only time you was able to get a Ford on console was the one when they did the New Holland slash Ford. I think that was the only time we was able to get Ford on console. And that's because it was basically the skin of a, a New Holland renamed. And that was only renamed as an option, just to change the sticker. That's the only time the console players were ever, or I was ever, at that point, was able to get a Ford. And it was useless. It was completely useless. It was a horrible thing. But just because it was the only way you could get a Ford, or you'd get a tractor and just paint it blue. Like a Fiat or something. Which is just weird. I don't know. Oh, jeez. Why am I going this way? So what's your favourite mod so far then, Stephen? I do like that six meter plow. Is that for console and PC? And I still use it for PC. That thing takes some beating, that does. But I have got a nice surprise for a plow slash cultivator thing. It's hideously beautiful, that's for sure. I've got to do, I do agree with the old John Deere 40 series and the International. Gotta love that International. Oh. The old levelling head. See the old wobble on it. Mine is that, as you know, that Oliver. Oh, love that Oliver. I even converted it for 22, and then about two weeks later, the maker of it converted it. And it was like, hmm. Okay. Uh, I use the Western theme for the in cab for the international. Ah. Nice. So what do you think to the uh, the TLX and all that? Not bad, are they? I've got to say, they're not bad. The old TLX. Say, Two Square Studios does make some good mods. So the black sheep modding. Well, a lot of modders make great mods. I like them. He does an awesome job. Yeah. Some of them can be a bit janky when they first come out, but oh, they're, they're brilliant mods. And the thing is. It does seem like, you know, he listens to the community.
I going to fill this up? I mean the harvester with this piece here. I don't mean the tra obviously I'm going to fill the trailer up. Alright, let's pop that in. Let's carry on. The rest of this done. As I did like the Phoenix. That was nice. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, you literally just said it, Phoenix. And uh, GX2020, Breakfast 22 now. Yeah. I was literally just about to say Phoenix. They are beautiful, they are. I know this is going to sound me, but I wasn't too keen on the pickups. On the old pickup trucks. I wasn't too keen on them. trucks themselves the actual trucks who knows they were awesome that's probably me just being a hypocrite because I like trucks I'm not really a pickup kind of guy never have been really I mean, don't get me wrong you know, the old F1 it's a nice truck Raptor, that's a nice truck, the real one. Never really been a big pickle truck kind of guy. And that's probably sounding really weird. Say, I do like his trucks. The pickup truck to me, it just seemed like there was too much for it. It was like, what is it meant to be? Is it this? Is it that? Is it that? Don't get me wrong, very versatile, very good pickup truck. It was really useful. But it was just it seemed like there was just too much. Don't get me wrong, it was still good. It was still very versatile. But I mean, if I ever made a mod like that, I, I could never get it to the amazing standard he does. I mean, it's not anything against him, it's just that pickup truck for me, just wasn't it. I think it did a lot for that, the role play if it's 19. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that is understandable, but for me, it just seemed a bit much for one thing. I mean, we could do like a variant of that truck. I don't know. Probably just my biased opinion. You know, everyone's got their own opinions on certain things and all this, that and the other. Don't get me wrong, I'll, you know, I'm not saying it's a bad mod, I love the mod. It's an amazing mod, but for me, it just seemed too busy, if that makes any sense. Nice. 
those itches. Sat here going. So happy to get this field done. We've almost done it. And we haven't cheated, you've seen through the whole stream. I do think there's like two little tufts over there. me the most is about losing all the mods the map and everything is all them hours I put on my loader all them hours I put on my loader there were a lot of hours on that thing I put a lot of time into Yukon and I mean the thing that annoys me the most as well is the fact that how much work I did behind the scenes um, setting up the realistic mining series one. Just for my mods to just, all of my mods to just vanish. Like I say, at the end of the day, is technology can't be helped. It's one of them things. Is it annoying? Does it pee me off? Of course it does. I'm only human, but things and I need to turn you yeah I was enjoying it yeah me too <sighs> me too buddy me too on this old beast it is doing me proud it really has and here is the last pieces of this field are you ready there it is it is done Next will be that field over there. Uh. All right, let's jump in this. Oh, send it to go over here. Yeah, a lot of time went into the Yukon. I mean, even behind it, well, you saw the hours I put just on my loader itself, let alone any other vehicle. Four hours for cheese. Damn. Oops. Damn. That's a fair few, isn't it? Get this unloaded. Get it put in the trailer in the silo, and then we will call it a stream.
definitely done me proud this thing has 4.2 hours on it and that's just in one field we've got a lot of bales it's definitely going to help uh, get them loaded up in that truck probably in the next live stream all that's left is that little bit over there to bail, this little bit over here to bail, and that's brilliant. I'm going to get some cows, uh, 15, it took a lot of damn straw, like a ridiculous amount of straw, whoa there, that was wobbly bobbins. So, it took 4 hours, 51 minutes to get that field done, but technically it didn't because, you know, we was sorting stuff out. Go through there. Let's have a quick fly up. Here we go. We harvested this field with a small harvester. There's a lot of work, but we got it done. We do own, however, I do believe it's that field, I think. I'm sure it is. Yeah, it is. That one there, we own that one there. Uh, we own, I think we own these two here. And that one over there, I believe. I think. But that is going to be it. I want to say a massive thank you to everybody that came in, that watched, hit the like, the shares, the follows, absolutely everything. If you are watching this on YouTube and you want to see more, don't forget, hit that like button, hit the thumbs up, hit subscribe, hit absolutely everything. And until then, have a fantastic day, and I will see you all tomorrow for some more live stream action.